We're going to keep this going. <laughs> as long as we can. Oh, but first we got like a ton of like inventory, man. We got a lot of, ton of boring shit to do actually right off the bat. Yeah, we got here. But now we have to manage our inventory. Alright, you know what? Let's just start putting food in the fridge. And stuff. Wow, it came. It comes with grapes, ham, and an onion. Sweet. Uh, how hungry are we? You know what? We're peckish. We're going to eat this cheese sandwich right now. Empty gas can. You know what? We're going to put that in the thing. This ham. Let's put that in the fridge. Sure. That's probably like a partially eaten ham, though. Okay, we're going to have to uh, examine this military backpack. We still haven't... Have we read this? Yeah, okay. You know what? We're actually going to, like, just drop this by the fire. Uh, so we can start a fire with it later. We'll start putting, like... Okay, let's... Um, yeah, cross... All, all this crap, eraser pen. Let's... We're going to probably just get rid of that stuff. Baseball hat. Pants. Paper clip. Okay, well... This is semi-useful stuff. Uh, we'll take the paper clip somewhere else. I'm never gonna wear that baseball cap. We might be able to use the other stuff for rags. So we're gonna we're gonna put this army cap in because it's interesting. Is there any other clothes we have to store? Not really at the moment. We're gonna we're gonna sort out this military backpack. We gotta remember to do that. Oh yeah, what's in here? Oh, we do we do have clothes. Yeah, we have. Uh, Oh, uh, wow, ghillie suit, bulletproof vest, which we're not going to wear because it's a little bit warm. The goal is to not get bit. Like, if we need protection, we're kind of doing it wrong. Uh, okay, this is like first 80 stuff. You know what? Let's start putting the cigarettes in this, like, drawer with the Bible readings here. You know, we'll keep the Bible. You know what? Maybe we should come up with a place to put... Put the CDs, I guess. I don't know. A cordless phone. Uh, yeah, let's let's start stacking cigarettes in here, I guess. This will be our cigarette drawer. Uh, so much inventory management. Okay, this is a box full of VHSs. <clears throat> well, I'll tell you what. It's now VHSs, CDs, and first aid. Well, I don't know. Are pills considered first aid? Uh, maybe, maybe first aid is the wrong word I'm looking for here. Uh, so this is like rando stuff. And oh, a sheet. Uh, I might need that for... Uh, okay, so... Well, yeah, we'll start putting... Stuff here. Stuff, yeah. Okay. How heavy are we? We still got a lot of stuff. Okay, there's like an... Okay, there's paper clip. Oh my god, this game. We'll put that in here. A pen? I, I don't know if I want a pen. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna drop the pen in our in this random box here. This will be our crap box. Along with a carpentry book, which we probably actually will want at some point. We haven't read that. Uh, so yeah, random box there. This eraser. And, uh, uh, and this baseball cap, I swear I'd never wore. It's too tight around the head. Nightcore Gaming. Awesome. Well, that's a cool name. Appreciate it. Thank you for the follow. Um, that's awesome. Thank you. <laughs> How's the not being food thing going? Yeah, it's going well so far. Thank you. Yeah, Nightcore. Yeah, appreciate it, buddy. <laughs> But with this game, as you probably know, it can go wrong like that, buddy. Yeah, so, you know, we'll see. Right now, I'm very I'm just doing some inventory management. It's quite boring. But uh, but soon, I'm going to <laughs> go actually do something. Uh, oh, I know. Yeah. <laughs> exactly, buddy. Oh, man, yeah. <clears throat> anyway, how's things going with you today? Are, are you... Are, I don't even. I don't even know. Are you, are you an expert at this game? Is it? Would you consider yourself an expert in zombies, in zomboids, and survival? Because uh, I certainly wouldn't. Tripped on a fence and got mauled. <laughs> That's the thing. The damn fences are freaking deadly, bro. Stay away from them. Fences, doors, corners, open space. <laughs> it's all kind of deadly. Alright, let's put this crossword magazine in here. 
Oh, my bourbon. That's right. You know, I kind of want to make a, a Molotov. Um, all right, this, this, all right. Okay, I think we can drop this duffel bag, drop that, and we'll equip this military backpack we found. That is so awesome. Equip on back. Oh, man, yeah, this is great now. This, we look like a real piece of work. All right, we're going to grab the duffel bag. Um, 111 hours. Yeah, okay. So I'm a, I'm, I'm a decent around. Awesome. Yeah, sweet, dude. Yeah. I'm not quite a masochist yet where, with all these, like, dude, I see some of these people that, like, playing mods that, you know, like, uh, you know, the Frozen, oh, God, what I, I forget what it's called, but, like, it's a winter mod, and just, it looks really hard. So I'm not quite to that point where I'm trying to make the game, like, impossible for myself. <laughs> but, yeah. Well, you know what? I'm going to take that shit. Uh, we're gonna drop this duffel bag because we might want to use it one day. Um, you know what? I think. Oh God, are we already getting drowsy? All right. Um, we we gotta try to stay up till eleven. Gotta keep a schedule in this game, as you probably know. Uh, more or less, uh, just play until you feel comfortable with stuff like that. Yeah, true enough. Yeah, yeah. Well, right now I'm kind, I'm kind of taking it easy on this playthrough because I'm, I'm just kind of want to explore uh, Louisville because I've, I've just never spent any time there. So uh, that's pretty much my goal here. It's just too late for me to go out tonight. It's it's 9:30, but but tomorrow, dude, I'm gonna head out and explore the local surroundings of Louisville. Uh, yeah, I never really spent any time there, so really, I, I'm just kind of, I'm just kind of bumming around this, this place. <laughs> really, I don't expect much. <coughs> Quiet, my sweet doggo. Let's see, you know what, I think I'm gonna take this opportunity to sit here and read this. I'll be right back, I'll check on my dog. Tell you, dogs hate the Amazon delivery guy even worse than the mailman because the Amazon delivery guy has to take a picture of the package. Uh, so where are we stationed? Oh, you're gonna love this, dude. This is some soft core stuff for you. Be prepared to be very underwhelmed. This is great. This is the big reveal. Uh, I am anx I'm anxious to show you this, dude, because nowhere, nowhere. In fact, <laughs> check my map, dude. Let's look at my map. I'm out. I'm out here. I'm right here. <laughs> I'm off the coast of because uh, I couldn't figure out how to mod the map in the ocean. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> We're kind of doing a subnautica cross <laughs> crossover. Yeah, now this is great. Now I modded myself in a little island here, just a safe place, so I could find good places in. Uh, in uh, in Louisville, cause I, I don't I don't know where to go. Like I said, I haven't spent any time here, so so yeah. <laughs> so not 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 a hardcore thing at all. But at least it's creative. I made my I modded in this little little area here. We're gonna we're gonna make it comfy though. We're we're gonna grow some food, maybe do some fishing. It's gonna be great. <laughs> so I think I'm gonna I'm gonna go to sleep now though. I uh, gotta make sure to close the door. I have yet to have the helicopter. What day is the helicopter on? Um, uh, th oh my God! Yeah, that map. So I'm like addicted to that. Yeah, but you know what? It's 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 one thing to like look at the map and like actually do it. So, like, because really, uh, why I'm here is because I was thinking I really want to do a playthrough like with my friends and shit. Like in that distillery that's like really close to here and so i wanted to, so that's kind of why i use this area because it's like kind of far away from from stuff but not too far away and it's a distillery so but yeah anyway we're gonna check that out tomorrow really haven't done anything we just got from we started in riverside we got here we ran the blockade 
you know what? Uh, we're gonna we're gonna go to sleep. We got we got to sleepies. But yeah, in fact, tomorrow we're gonna go check out the distillery. I need uh, stuff. I need a fridge. I need I need a freezer. You know, one of those big ice cream freezers. You know, that's what I need to do. I need to go to the gas station, wherever that is. Find me an ice cream freezer. Oh, oh, you know what? Where's that? Uh... The helicopter will occur between days 6 and 9. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. And between 9 a.m. and 8 p.m. Um, yeah, that, you know, I never get lucky with the emergency broadcast thing. Uh, I never really try very hard, but I'm not good at finding radios. <laughs> you know? But yeah, yeah. So we'll see how that goes. I hope I'm not like caught out by that. Let's see. We did. We did catch. We did get a rain barrel, rain collector, from Riverside. Let's go plop that on our roof before we do anything, just in case it starts raining. Um, we we want all the all the moisture. Uh, place item. Sweet. Okay. Boom. Liquid. Liquid incoming. Check all radios you see and either write down the station or take the radio with you. Yeah, you know. The, yeah, good call, Minnie. Buddy. Uh, the thing is, man, those crazy devs, you know, randomized it, you know? I mean, they thought of everything. Huh? So you couldn't just know, oh, the emergency frequency is this, you know? They, they randomized it every playthrough. I got to respect that. Let's go. Let's go actually eat a burger. One of our last burgers from, from the apocalypse. Let's eat it. Eat all burger. Uh, do we have enough water? How, how, how full is our... Oh, it's let's fill it, refill it from our sink before we head out. Oh, do we not have water? That's, yeah, oh, yeah, we do. There we go. Just, you got to click on the thing, actually. You got to click on the thing. All right, boom. We're good. <clears throat> all right, let's go explore. I gotta really baby this vehicle. Uh, as you can see, I've already gotten quite a bit of blood on it. It's in gore. It's really not good. I'm sure it's like transmitting some sort of disease. I wonder, I guess in the lore, like the zombie thing was like, uh, it rained down from the skies. So, I, I mean, I don't know. I don't know how you like prevent that. Oh, we can't have these dudes like marching next to our house. We gotta start clearing this out. I like playing with zombie respawn often, either sometimes or often helicopter. Oh, often helicopter event. I don't know about that. <laughs> I just have it once. Uh, oh, dude, that dude had like a like a helmet on. No one knows uh, where the virus is from. It. Oh, okay. Some say it's from Spiffo. Oh, really? If it was the burger place? Damn, dude. That would be such a betrayal. I've loved I've loved those burgers for for so many decades. I remember those from the eighties. Do you remember Spiffo burgers? They were great. That would be sad to me if if they had something to do with the plague. You know, what? actually, we're gonna. Yeah, like I said, we're gonna drive down the road. I think there's a gas station, and we're gonna. Oh man, see. Oh, okay, look at all these zombies. Look at all these zombies. That's not good to me. The Spiffo Baggies. It's in the Baggies. I wonder if they're like made of like zombie cattle or something, dude. I wonder if that's the thing. <laughs> uh, okay, yeah, there's a grocery store there. Okay. Ooh, okay, policemen. Okay, what we're really here for is the is the fridge. I hope they have a fridge. We're going to leave our, our truck on here. All right, we're going to have to clean this out. Oh, we're agitated. We're going to have to remember to have a smoke. Oh, I'm, I'm screwed when this ass... Ooh, a, a policeman. Okay, okay, they're coming in now. Okay, how many... Oh my gosh, okay. Uh... Can we do this? Oh, oh, I don't want him behind me. I don't like that. 
Oh my. I just want, I'm just here for the fridge. Oh my, okay, all right. Wow, that's that's a lot of them, dude. Yeah, I, 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 oh my God. Yeah, did you take it? Stress out because you saw your loved ones die? Yeah, no, no, just haven't had a smoke in a while. <laughs> Nothing gets to me without with 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 my with my tobacco uh, armor on, <laughs> but yeah, you're right. Let's I must have a smoke after that. Uh, oh yeah, that's right. I got a fanny pack with my smokes in it. Let's have a cigarette. Ah yeah, the blood. <laughs> okay, yeah, we're anxious. Yeah, we needed that smoke. Boom. There we go. It went away. Excellent. Um, <laughs> Wow, okay, all right, let's stay on track here. I hope there's one of those big freezers here. Those, like, outdoorsy one things? Oh, maybe there's not. I really don't know. Uh, there usually is at gas stations. Hello there, uh, Sir Skip. Uh, good to see you. Thank you, Waz. Good to see you, buddy. How are you today, man? How's things? How's life? Anything new with you, buddy? Yeah, we're just, we're just out exploring. We're looking for a freezer now. Ah, there's the freezer. There's the freezer that we were looking for, and it has, uh, does it have stuff in it? It has ice cream in it, so yeah, we're taking the ice cream. Dude, that's sweet. Uh, yeah, we're taking all the ice cream out of it and putting it in our backpack. And now we're going to, hopefully we can lift it up without it sh shattering into a million pieces. I like to have a fanny pack with smokes. <laughs> My dead rat named Jerry and a cockroach Richard. <laughs> that's great. That's about all that would fit in there, I imagine, Nightcore. You know, yeah, I, I keep my smokes in there. I, I like to keep my uh, my can opener, but I don't have one on me yet, you know? But yeah, that's good. Yours, I think yours is better. I just, because cause that way, you know, the smoke's kind of the priority. Yeah, right. Well, I mean, that way the tobacco, like, kind of fuses with the dead rat stench. Uh, I'm devastated. Sad heartbroken. It's a great shame to bring sad news. I broke my mug that's dear. Oh, you broke your favorite mug, Waz. Oh, damn it. Ah, oh, damn it. That's a bad feeling. What'd you do? Was it your fault? Did you, did you, did you like, uh, break it in a fit of rage railing at your computer? You gotta take the essentials. <laughs> yeah. I never pick up the dead rats. So, I mean, you're braver than me. With how the disease works in this game, it's so mysterious. I, like, don't try to touch stuff like that, you know? So, oh, did, did, did you broke it yourself. Oh, Waz, dude, come on, man. That sucks. That that sucks when you're only yourself to blame. You know, I wish you could, like, yell at your brother or something. But, no, okay, let's... Are we picking it up? Yes! Okay, it didn't shatter. So, let's take a piece at a time. Popsicle fridge, one out of two. Boom, and we're full. So, let's get to our truck. Uh, make sure our truck is selected. Okay, and put the popsicle fridge in it. Damn, it's like 20 pounds. That's uh, like 15 or something. I want to play together sometime. I'm down. Oh, well, appreciate the offer, Nightcore. I appreciate that. Thank you. I know how hard it is to, uh, you know... Uh, Sort of coordinate times, you know, but yeah, appreciate the offer for sure. Thank you. Might consider that. <clears throat> the thing is, as you know, everything, uh, we're in fact, me and Waz were just having this, uh, this conversation yesterday. Everything's better when you're playing with friends, you know, so like, uh, you can play some pretty crappy games, uh, with friends and have them be pretty fun, you know, so. Okay, I think that's great. We got a freezer. We're going to start really hoarding the ice cream now. Uh, we'll be back for this weird junk stuff here. In fact, we're going to eat these right now. Snow globes. I used to love those when I was a kid. They weren't called that. They were snowballs, but. Oh, man, these eggs. Oh, dude. You know what? You know what we're going to do? Oh, man. I, I'm tempted to take eggs. I don't know what you really do with them. I guess you can fry them. Stuff is connected there. Oh, thanks. Thanks, Nightgore. Appreciate it. Yeah, thank you. Appreciate the info. Yeah. So, yeah, I'll check back at the on the on that. Yeah. Thank you, buddy. Any good achievements? 
Uh, any good achie achievements in this game, buddy? Uh, the, the personal achievements? I mean, I, you know, I think because I've modded the game, I actually don't get any achievements. It's bring interesting you get that, you bring that up, but, uh, you know what, like, we're gonna take this cheese. That I consider that an achievement. In fact, some of the last milk that will ever, <laughs> will ever exist. Um... Uh, you know what? The rest of this is going to have to... You know, I'll eat this. I'll eat this yogurt right now. Oh, they don't have achievements in this game. Okay. They don't have achievements. That's how little achievements I'm getting. Yeah. I'm thinking... I was just playing Bannerlord the other day, and that, and that's the one where it has achievements, but I mod it, so it's... Uh, so it kills it. So I just kind of assume that does it with every game. Anyway... At least right now. I'm sure they will eventually, right? Like, you got it. They could come up with some really silly ones. Oh, an empty gas can. Sweet. We're going to take that again. We're just going to keep hoarding gas. A West Point map. I think we already have. have. Hmm, mechanics Volume 2. We haven't even read a Volume 1 yet. Ooh, another empty gas can. That's awesome. We're taking empty stuff now. Okay, and then a bunch of junk food. Hmm, okay. Wow. Okay, wow. This is an awesome place. Anything in these? Ooh, sheets. You know, I'll take some sheets. An empty bucket. Hmm, that's tempting. You know what? I think yes. I think yes. We're going to take an empty bucket. Military green camo shirt. Now we're going to leave that. Got to bounce. Check back. Uh, stream keep the grind, my guy. Yeah, Nightcore. Thank you. Thank you for joining me, buddy. Have a good, good uh, day, buddy. Take care of yourself. Thanks for stopping by. All right, let's 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 do this up. Let's do this up. Let's see. Um. Oh, man. Oh, oh, gummy bears. You ever eaten gummy bears, Waz? Uh, there's uh, one of my favorite YouTubers. Uh, well, there's a couple of YouTubers that, like, eat gummy bears as a challenge. And it, like, shreds your insides, dude. It, like, shreds your guts. And you just, like, shit gummy bears. You know what I mean? It's terrible. Like, uh, they can eat... A, they, a lot of these YouTubers did some sick sick eating challenges, but that's one of the worst. Dude. Anyway, let's, let's resume. Yeah, I have ate them, but I, I don't like them much. You know, I don't like them much either. It's, it's crazy how, like, candy gets made and it's not even that good and people just kind of go along with it. I don't know. I don't like gummy bears. <laughs> I'd rather have myself a, what is this? What did it say? A cheese sandwich fresh. Hell yeah, I'd have that in the corn dog bucket. Burrito, muffin. I'm gonna eat this yogurt right now. I'll do that. Oh my, okay, we got books here. Let's see. Uh, okay, unread this book about cars. We'll read a book about cars. Okay, I, I guess that's all I'm gonna I'm gonna take of that. Yeah. The, oh, the the Twinkie equivalent. We're gonna take that. Anything in here? Plastic bag. Okay. Now we're done. We're done. You know what? We're gonna get out of here for now. This is a good place though for expire for like non-expiring food. Damn! Look at all these cigarettes and matches and stuff. That's awesome. We're gonna add that to the collection. All right. Let's. Um... Oh, I guess because this is a gas station, there was a lot of gas cans in the back. I guess that sort of makes sense. Finally, uh, um, an in, in, in eight burglar is happy. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, we're looting. We're finally looting. <laughs> in fact, we're going to take fuel and fill all. We're just going to fill all these gas cans and, and hoard them back at base. See, once the power goes out, Waz... These will stop working. In fact, we got to go back to the, that that checkpoint Charlie up there and, like, get a, a generator so we can power this gas station, basically. Uh, what what am I doing? Oh, it's near here, here. Here's the thing. Em empty gas can. No, I, th I thought I hit fill all gas can there. Uh, let's, uh, let's get more gas. We're just going to really go crazy with this shit. Let's see. Take fuel... Yep, 
Yeah, see, and then, you know, we like power at our house. See, I just collected a freezer, so I gotta go get a generator for the for, for my house, too. So basically, two generators are needed. Let's see, can we take more fuel empty gas? Yeah, buddy. I don't know. I like this kind of game where it's, like, really minutiae. You know what I mean? I don't know how to say it. Micromanagey, I guess you could say. I don't know. It's not micromanagey. That's not the proper word. But, you know, it's like the simulation is very, uh, very, very fine, as it were, you know, with with gas and, uh, you know, like you don't have to put gas in your cars in GTA. You know, that the, the simulation is not fine there. You know what I mean? Uh, I, I don't know quite the word for it. Uh, you know, it's, it's very uh, realistic, I guess. I don't know. It's not realistic, though. But, you know, I don't know. All right, you know what we're going to do? It's 12 p.m. We're going to go to the checkpoint. We're going to go up to the military checkpoint right now. Now that we have all this gas. Agreed. Love it, too. Yeah, it's a good game. Oh, you know what, though? Oh, man. You know what, though? We're going we're gonna to just... We're going to not do that today. We're going to just explore this rich person's house here. And just kind of get our inner steel on. You know what we need, Waz? We do not have a cooking pan to properly cook with. I want a big pot. A big pot to throw all my crap in and stew it up. Make me some fresh stews. That's what I need. There's not one back at the base. So we need to find ourselves a stew pot. Like, you can't cook in the bucket. I, I think I tried that previously. Unless you can now. All right, let's go find ourselves a stew pot. Oh, I hear banging around in here. Or do I? Maybe I don't. What the hell was that? CD sarcastic. Sarcastic. Tony Williams. Hmm. What the hell was this? Did oh, a double barrel shotgun in the closet with a box of shotgun shells. We're going to take that. I'm going to take that. All right. Um, boom. Too bad we too, we're too chicken to actually use the shotgun. We'll probably never use that, in fact. Mm. Okay, a bandage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's good. That's good. Oh, soap. We can wipe ourselves with the soap better. Uh, and tweezers. We're going to finally hoard some tweezers. Yeah, you know what? Uh, and this sheet. We're going to take this sheet. Who keeps sheets under the sink? I don't know. Maybe, maybe that's a thing people do. I guess you got no other space to put them. It's better there than, you know, on the floor and outside. Flip-flops. I would never wear flip-flops during the apocalypse. Would you wear flip-flops during the apocalypse? I guess if you had no better shoes, I suppose, but I'd prefer, like, a pair of those. Like, didn't you say you had some metal boots from your days uh, as an electrician? That's what you should be wearing during the apocalypse, dude. Metal fucking boots. Is that another shotgun with, with more shotgun shells? This this house is awesome. Uh, it's, it's it's the sawed-off, but or, or, or double barrel, I mean, but it's still awesome. All right, only a few shells, that's okay. Metal boots, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, a zombie would have a hard time cutting through them with his teeth, you know what I mean? Really bad when running, hmm. That's true. That's true. It would slow down your speed by whatever percentage. Beanie hat. A pillow. You know what? Let's take a pillow. Okay. Hang on, I gotta check, check my doggo boost. Hang on. I don't know if I'm expecting a package or not. I saw the Amazon guy out there. Concentrate. 
Oh, you know, I need to steal myself a better bed, too. That's what I need to look around for, is a better bed. Oh, duct tape, I want that. I want the duct tape. Oh, I took it, okay. Took the duct tape. Where is that banging coming from? Blonde hair dye, nah. Oh, a dead mouse, fresh uncooked. I don't, I'm, no, we'll take the toilet paper for decoration, maybe. Strawberry blonde hair dye. I wonder, can I, can I dye my beard in this game? It's already, like, grown out a little bit. A mirror, hmm, do we need the mirror? I guess we'll take that. Um, should we take the dead mouse? I wonder. It's fresh. It's an uncooked, fresh dead mouse. I wonder. Um, I guess I guess we're not gonna take it for now. We're we're gonna take the soap though. Pretty won't take long. Oh yeah. Okay. Well, good luck, buddy. Yeah. Um. Hmm. Oh man, this is a this is a dilemma here. Um. You know what? No, we're gonna we're gonna probably find more. I would think, if we want to like start a collection, I don't know how they work. I mean, doesn't doesn't it is eventually just rot away? All right, where is there? We need like a single bed that has good quality rating about it. Is this one a single bed? This is. Does it? Let's see. Sleep? Can I can I sleep on it? <clears throat> quality good. Yeah yeah yeah. Let's pick it up. May maybe. Uh, I won't shatter it to a million pieces. Oh, yeah! Oh, it's because I was drinking Mountain Dew at that time. It gave my gave me the gaming skill to... Okay, simple bed. One of one of two. And, I, and I'm over in comfort. All right, we'll come back. Who is, why is... Where's that banging? It's somewhere in this household, dude. Oh, I'm, I'm actually taking health damage from it being so heavy. That's not good. Let's um, hurry up with that. Let's put it in the thing. Boom. Oh my, are were we? Uh, oh, we're like at capacity, dude. Right, so we're going to like have to store the other one somewhere else. Like uh, in the front seat maybe or something. Um, grab simple bed. Oh, okay, you know what, let's run. We, we're, we're taking health damage, this ain't good. I'm like hurting my back or something. I'm getting herniated. A ruptured lumbar. Oh, yep, yeah. what did I just say? I just said, do I gotta put it in the front seat? All right, let's get in. Can I put it in the front seat? Is it, uh, it's 20 pounds. Will it, will it go in the... Wow, yeah, it'll just fit. Okay, and here we go. We're out of here to go begin our new life with our new bed. I really don't like a milling around my my cheaty modded uh, house, uh, but yeah, you know we gotta like tow these cars out of the way or something. We gotta check that one. That'd be a nice one to have, huh? Um, oh, see, so yeah, they're collecting flies. I wonder when the flies start collecting about them. Uh, does that mean they're, like, transmitting disease or something? Can you get sick from that? I wonder... That, that thing comes upon me real quick. Um, alright, let's thusly turn it off. Get out. Let's shut this. I'm very paranoid. Let's shut the gate. Alright, now, uh, here's what I'm gonna do. Let's, let's get the, uh, the simple bed out. Oh my, yeah, we're, we're 32 friggin' pounds. Yeah, alright, let's go plop this down in here. We're going to put it over here in the corner, maybe, or something. Uh, drop it like it's hot. Okay. Um, a box, a pocket full of shells. Okay, well, you know what? I don't know where the hell we're going to start storing that kind of thing. I guess we'll store it here. Um, Matt! Uh, hello, what's up? Oh, man. Not much with me. How about with you, Matt? What's new with you, buddy? How's life? 
What's new with you? You always got something exciting happen to you, buddy. It's good to see you, man. Uh, it's good. It's good to see. I'm, I, I always love it when you show up. Double barrel shotgun uh, and a, and a pump shotgun. Um, uh, you know, it's funny when you show up, dude. I did in it did win lottery not much but 5k really really you won some money in the in the lottery bro in that turkish lottery that's great dude uh that that might not be much but it, that doesn't matter the point is you got free stuff you know what i mean that's awesome bro really that's cool man congratulations <laughs> good stuff buddy wow that that light that brightens my day that's awesome, man. Uh, that's cool stuff. Yeah, shotguns. You, you know, it's funny. You, you show up when I'm thinking shotguns. Man, there is this shotgun that, that they make in your country that I really want. Let, let me actually see if I can find a picture of it. Let's see. Yeah, um, let's see. Damn it. I, I, I'm not sure because, of course, it's a Turkish name. Oh, yeah, here we go. Here's a picture of it, I think. <laughs> um, wow, yeah. <laughs> see that thing? I need this. I need this in in every in every game that I play. They make that over there, buddy. So yeah, I thought that. I thought I thought I, th I thought of you when I saw that. I was like, damn, dude. Like, damn. They, I I I need to start buying Tur Turkish Turkish guns. Uh, you did you found lots of cigarettes? Oh yeah, I found lots of cigarettes, buddy. Yeah, we're hoarding the cigarettes. My your internet's bad. Oh, a bad internet. Damn it. Damn it, Matt. Yeah, unfortunately, that's the way it goes, unfortunately. The internet just sucks all over the place. I don't know why. Uh, empty bucket. You know, we're going to put this empty bucket outside. To collect fluids. Possibly urine, vomit, other things like that. Um, oh, I came at the right moment. It's the bullpup. Yeah, dude, we were just talking about uh, Matt's favorite shotgun. Like, um, like, like, um, like one week, man. Uh, yeah, um, uh, <clears throat> yeah. Good, good old Matt. Good old Matt shows up. Mit, 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 I wonder. Do you pronounce your? Is it like mite, mite, or something? Mite, mite. <laughs> I don't know. Is it? Is it? I don't know. Cause yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I'll, I'll just give up <laughs> like I did before. <laughs> but yeah, I wish I could pronounce your name properly, dude. But yeah, we'll just go with Matt, <laughs> I guess. Um, <coughs> let's see, this this um, a mirror pillow. Oh, wait, that's right. I got myself a um, a pillow. Let's let's um, keep it for a second. We gotta get this other part of the bed. What is called shotgun? Um, uh, uh, yeah, it's 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 like a, a company called like Garrisia or something. I don't know how to pronounce it. Uh, G A Y A S E R A S R or something. I, I I don't really know, you know. And yeah, it's a bullpup shotgun, dude. It's made in Turkey apparently. So yeah. Um. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Okay. Okay. Where? Where did it? Where's? It's a. It's a bed. Here it is. Here we get what props are called. Oh, simple bed. Simple bed. In fact, let's put it there. Boom. Sim simple bed. I need another cigarette. It's tough being a smoker. It's tough. Tough being addicted. Uh, place item, I believe. All right. Yeah. 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 Boom. We're building ourselves a bed. <clears throat> Because you have to take it apart and build it in this game. You can't just, like, move a bed around, which is bizarre to me. I've moved so many beds in my life, it's not even funny. Um, anyway, anyway. So what are you going to do with your money, dude? You're going to go blow it all on, uh, on uh, 
on uh, I don't know Turkish baths or whatever <laughs> I forget what they call them. Yeah, I don't know. What, what are you gonna do, dude? You got any good plans? You should buy yourself better PC parts, dude. You know what I mean? That's what I do with any kind of money I had. That's what I do with any kind of money I have. I need a better camera. Uh, can you type a name? You know what? Sure. Let me let me try to spell check it first. Um, let's see. Uh, Let's see. Okay, yeah, here it is right off their uh, their website here. Let's let's show you their website. It's it's right here. That's how you'd pronounce it. I don't know. How would you pronounce that, buddy? You and your people in your Turkish names. I can't pronounce a single one of them. It's called the Fear 109. Yeah, so when it, anything that's with it's called a Fear 109, it it must be uh, you know, must be good. So <laughs> close that it's awfully bright all right resume but yeah i need that in like every game i play dude like what the hell it's cut to to time um you say name shotgun <laughs> i don't know how to say it bro did, did i did you not catch it did, did, did it cut out let me, <laughs> let me let me let me show you it i, I don't know i can i can uh you know um yeah, it's this. I don't know how to say that. I don't know how to say that. Gera, 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 Yesar? Geraesar. Geraesar, maybe? Geraesar. The Fear 109. There we go. I don't know. I don't know, buddy. I don't know. I'm sorry to make such a big deal out of it. It's really not that important. Anyway, we're moving on now. <laughs> uh, yeah, big old 12 gauge. Yeah, dude. Hell yeah, man. All right. Yeah, that'd be fu fun to play with in the backyard, eh, buddy? Shooting your cans out there in Turkey. Like name sh shotgun. Yeah, 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 right, yeah. Yeah, can't go wrong, buddy. I mean, come on. They should give you a discount because you live in the same country. They don't have to ship it as far. They should get buy, you know, buy one, get one free type of thing, and then you can ship one out to me, buddy. Anxious on edge. Let's let's smoke a cigarette. Okay. <laughs> I I think that that's you know one of you know let's let's be honest. We might be uh, separate peoples, but we can be can you know the Turkish and the Americans can be reunited on their love of firearms. I think. You know what I mean? I think that's our common ground, buddy. As long as we got that to, to kind of cooperate on, you know, we're fine. Peace can come through weapons. All right, let's <laughs> let's um. Uh, what am I? What am I? Uh, is it? Yeah, the sheets I don't need. Uh, this pipe wrench. I, you know, I'm gonna start storing like 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 tools and stuff. A mirror. Sure, we're gonna keep a mirror in here. This ice cream I gotta take out. Damn it! Let's put it in the freezer. Why this? It's probably melty now. Oh damn it! It's not 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 that. I need it in the freezer. Freezer. Yeah. Boom. Ice cream. That's some good ice cream. We're gonna be eating on that someday. I have a silver handgun. Oh sweet, dude. Yeah, you gotta protect thyself from from the other Turkish peasants roaming around wanting your goods and services. You know, free of charge. Hell yeah, dude. Good, good on you, buddy. Uh, let's see. Oh, we gotta put the milk in the fridge too. Um. Uh. Oh, we're gonna go put that pillow on that bed. Cause that's something a person would do. Let's see. Can we? What is it? R to. Is that actually on the bed? Or... Yeah, it is. We now have a pillow on our bed. Sweet. That's awesome. Excuse me. All right. Uh, here's what I need to do now. We're going to eat this muffin. There's a lot of inventory management in this game. <laughs> in fact, we're going to go put the, our soap over here. Where are we going to keep our soap? Like like there? Okay, yeah, we'll, we'll keep our soap in here. 
Ooh, t toilet paper. Can we, uh, where are we going to put our toilet paper? Where would we theoretically take a shit? I don't know. Um, I don't know. Over here, maybe? Oh, maybe we'd lean up against this tree, huh? Uh, we'll plop some down there. There you go, boom. That's our little, that's our little shit tree. That tree's going to be, like, really well fertilized, dude. Handgun is all part is silver, not inside part is metal. Yeah, yeah, not not in not in, yeah, right. But uh, yeah, that's awesome though, dude. A s silver, huh? Is it like just like silvery? I mean, just not actual silver. That'd be weird if it was made out of silver. I don't know that that would even make a good gun. But yeah, shiny. Yeah, I know what you mean. I know what you mean. Silvery, you know. <laughs> so yeah. Or maybe it is silver. I don't know. Maybe they just roll blingy down there in Turkey, man. Damn, I don't. I don't have a silver gun. That'd be, that'd be awesome. <laughs> that'd be cool. That's like you're like a James Bond villain, dude. That's awesome, dude. Except you know, except the man with the golden gun is a man with the silver gun, and and instead of like whatever else, he's, he's in this in this version, he's like a he's a he's a he's a he's a crazed Turkish chef that's that's become a mafia boss, you know. So. Anyway, we're getting off the topic here. <laughs> Let's put this, uh, this duct tape away. We're going to eat this corn dog. Man, we we require a lot of food. We're going to put these shotgun shells in our shotgun box. we got to get organized. This is this is something else. Um, this is our shotgun box. Boom. And we need we need to put our tweezers in, in with our... Our... First aid, yes. Lighter and matches. Where do we keep that? We're not going to put that in with the cigarettes because, I mean, you never put your ammo in with the gunny. It, it looks like a 1911. Oh, sweet, dude. Uh, see, now you're tickling the American in me, dude. You know what I mean? Every American loves a good 1911, dude. Oh, it's a 30-round handgun. Holy shit, dude. Nice. 30-round handgun. That's, that's interesting, man. Cool. It sounds very American. I like it's got 30 rounds and it looks like a 1911. I like that, buddy. I like I like the cut of your jib on that one, dude. Let's see. Uh, let's see. Full auto or semi-auto. Really? You can have full auto out there? That's sweet, dude, huh? <laughs> I can't do that, unfortunately, because I unfortunately is not am not as free as you, apparently. So that's that kind of depresses me. Um, shall not be infringed, I suppose, but yeah. Let's see. <laughs> Let's uh, go over here to the... Uh, boom, we need, to, we need to store this food. And burritos. We need to store the burritos. Uh, and the plonkies. Where are we storing plonkies? Let's start a box of plonkies here. Oh, cigarettes and... Okay, this bandage, we're just going to put that in our inventory. And then... Uh, oh, I think we still have a bandage on our hand, right? Yeah, in fact, let's take that off right now. Dirty bandage, remove bandage. From when we got, like, scratched. Okay, and we're good. Sweet. So I guess let's wash off this bandage. Can we do that? Clean bandage. Yeah, sweet. Uh... Okay, you know what? We're going to put this book away for now. And, oh my, yeah, we have so much organi organizations to do, dude. Organizing. Have you, have you ever wished for the apocalypse, Matt? Have you ever yearned for it? Have you ever wished for it in your heart? Have you ever thought, dude, I want the frickin' zombie apocalypse to hurry up and get here because I really don't want to go to work today. Or whatever, you know. 140 cigarettes to our collection. Sweet. Um, okay, yeah, hey, we're getting organized now. Okay, what do we have to do now? We, we need to take our, we need to put together our freezer is what we need because we need to really start hoarding weird everything food. Uh, let's see, where is that? popsicle fridge let's put it in our in our this this inventory um, and we're full so let's take this half of it over here it's a heavy fridge instead of moving it we're just we, we took it apart which is weird to me uh 
let's grab this. Uh, boom. Hmm, where are we going to put this? Let's put it... Uh, oh, my. Let's put it... Sure. We'll put it over here in the corner. Boom. Ice cream fridge. That's so awesome. You can hear that hum, huh? That great hum of those big freezers like that. That's great. I love that. Reminds me of good times. You know, they get so dusty behind them and under them and whatever. I just love the dust. It reminds me of ice cream. Um, you know what? Let's... um. Uh, you know what we need to do is start making some more boxes to store our stuff. It's already 8 p.m. Uh, all right, you know what? Let's we... Uh, oh, man. Uh, a gas can. All right, this is all gas, right? Let's take all this out. How much does this weigh in gas? Let's see. Dude, okay, is this going to, like, cripple me because I'm carrying it? All right, let's just dump our gas over here. We got four gas cans. That's so sweet. Boom. Okay, yeah gas for days buddy now all we need is a generator to put the gas in to make it like useful to us somehow oh you know what we can do oh man you know what hang on this bandage can we yeah let's disinfect bandage with bourbon and then now we're gonna you know what we're gonna take one of the gas cans grab one and we're gonna fill the bourbon oh, damn do we need a we need a ripped rag for this don't we or do we we're gonna let's try it without a rip drag. I can't remember what what how you make a Molotov in 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 game lore here. Let's see. We um. Can I not just click on it? Do I have to make it through here somehow? Uh. Make Molotov cocktail. Okay, I would need. Oh, yeah, yeah, I do need rag. Rag needed. Yeah, all right, all right, all right. So let's let's get a sheet and start ripping it up. Oh, wait, no, there were some pants that I wanted to rip up. Yeah, the random pants, just called pants. What kind of pants they are, we might never know. Uh, rip clothing. And we now have four rip sheets. Sweet. For Sar, uh, 109T. Okay, I will do that, Matt, because... Because you've earned that, dude. Because uh, you're such an honorable citizen. Uh, let's see. Um, Oh, yeah, is that what you got, buddy? Except silvery, huh? Uh, no, I mean, surely not, right? <laughs> oh, that, that's an awesome one, huh, buddy? <laughs> that's cool. <laughs> oh, man, you can't go wrong with that. That's you down there, buddy. This could be you. That's awesome, huh? That's danky shit. I want one of those, huh? That's awesome. <laughs> Yeah, you, you gotta have that during the apocalypse, man, resume. Yeah, good old... Yeah, I mean, can't go wrong. Unfortunately, in this game, the, the, the guns just aren't really that good. Um, uh, so I don't really strive to, to get them. You know, unlike in real life, where they're friggin' deadly as hell. Uh, <laughs> like, like, they're super effective. Uh, against this zombies, I don't know. I mean, they have, like, zombie-y guns, you know what I mean? Like, see, I don't think that you could have, like, a gun like that in a zombie movie. You never would, Matt, and let me tell you why. Because if they use blanks, it won't have the force to, like, cycle the action and kick back the, the chamber and all that and make it, like, work. Uh, so, like, that's why they use, like, revolvers in these movies and, like, double-barrel shotguns, as, as, as silly as that is, because you don't have to show it working or anything. You know, you just use the blanks and, bam, everyone's convinced. So, yeah, you can't have cool guns like that in a, in a zombie lore, dude, unfortunately. Um, okay, are we, are we still on this making, uh... Can we, can we just, oh yeah, make Molotov cocktail. All right, boom. Uh, so we now have, let's drop this gas can. We now have 
Uh, we need to put these rip sheets away, I guess. Um, so yeah, that only makes one, unfortunately. Let's put uh, rip sheets back. Because we got enough bandage. I guess we could... Uh, um, let's see. Let's use some more of our bourbon here to sterilize this bandage. Do we have any bourbon? Oh, I think we stored it in the truck. Yeah, yeah, six bourbon. Oh, wait, yeah, take it all out and we'll store it inside. In fact, we should go hoard more bourbon. I just like the roleplay of that. Uh, so let's bandage, uh, disinfect. Okay, and then um, put, put bourbon in here with the newspaper. That'll be a good fire hazard, huh? Putting some old newspaper in with the bourbon. Um, it punch punch hole in bear. <laughs> yeah, all right. Uh, if you buy the the Turkish gun, yeah, yeah, that uh, that twelve gauge uh, bullpup shotgun, dude. God, dude, yeah. Look, it's awesome as <laughs> shit. Yeah, yeah. I would never shoot it at a bear, unfortunately. But yeah, <laughs> but you can have some fun with it at the range. I tell you what. But yeah, yeah, uh, poor bears wouldn't stand a chance. Yes, yeah, so <laughs> I wouldn't. I wouldn't. I wouldn't do that. But, but yeah, that way you could do that though. Is is you know the theoretical truth? You know what I mean? But oh man, yeah, yeah, that's the dream. If only I just had like just a ton of cash sitting around and a bunch of land. I need a big space of land, you know, where, where, uh, you know, where, where I, where you know. Where I won't, I won't keep anybody up with the noise, you know? Except for maybe, maybe some wild animals out roaming around. It's ten! We're drowsy. What can we do to be proactive? We got about another hour. I guess we could just, let's sit outside and read our book about fishing. We'll sit in the rain. Oh, and we're collecting some good water there in our bucket. I don't know why we're collecting that water. I guess just for, you know, to have a bucket full of water. Like, we ha we live right next to a river. All right. Oh, are we already hungry again? We need so much food. Let's see. What, what else do we have to eat? Uh, we'll eat this cheese sandwich. We, we shoot bear if it come near town. Yeah, well, there you go. Yeah, yeah. That's true enough. Yeah, yeah. Now you can't have them uh, wandering around the city, um, you know, eating people's uh, boiled potatoes. You know, I'm back. I left the boiled potato boiling. Gonna make French style mashed potatoes. Oh man, French style mashed potatoes. Oh my God, you're you're fancy, dude. I only know about French fries. You know what I mean? Um, sometime hello. Uh, good to see you. Yeah, buddy, it's good to see you, old Matt. I thought I'd scared him away, but no, he was just he was just celebrating uh, winning his 5,000K in his lottery or whatever, the weird Turkish lottery that they have. So that's awesome, buddy. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah, we're with bed sleepies now. Sleepies. Uh, sleep. In our good quality bed. Hell, this is this is great to sleep in a good quality bed, except it, unless it, uh, not on the couch. Yeah, isn't that great, huh? Isn't that, good, isn't, that, isn't that good for him? Finally, some luck happening around here, you know? Like, usually he'd be fined $5,000, you know? Like, sir, you can't walk around with that, that sneering look on your face. You're not better than everyone else here. That'll be $5,000, you know? <clears throat> Like, sir, you're not allowed to have that awesome haircut when the rest of us are suffering with haircuts like this. That'll You have to cut off your hair and that'll be $5,000 immediately. Fork it over to the Turkish government right now. That's usually what happens on his normal day. Let's see. Uh, Malatov cocktail now. So, yeah, we're going to have fun with that. How much How much durability is on this axe? Okay, pretty good still. Uh, okay, yeah, 7.30 a.m. Let's, let's eat another thing out of our fridge. We're gonna need a source of food pretty, pretty quick here. Eat this sandwich. Uh, with bad girls? 
<laughs> yeah, right, exactly. Yeah, that's what you're doing with the money. Yeah, exactly. Celebrating with, with bad girls. Yeah. Uh, time to make that boats and hoes music video. Yeah, that's what he was doing. Basically, yeah, he's on a yacht somewhere. Basic, basically living a rap video. Yeah, so... <laughs> Like I imagine, he, he's he's still in his like tiny Turkish apartment, but now he's got like gold chains and stuff. <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh wait, what's that one? Let's do that. Uh, um. <laughs> Remember that one meme, dude? <laughs> that one meme. Yeah. Yeah, that remember this dude that 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 that's that's Matt right now, you know. <laughs> remember that guy? I love that guy. Yeah, that that's him right now, except on a yacht with with as he puts it, bad girls. You know what I mean? <laughs> but yeah, well he's he's Hindu, but you know, see, you get the idea though. <laughs> anyway, let's uh, get back at it. Uh, all right, let's see. Um, let's see. Uh, okay, you know, I don't want to carry this garden saw around. You know what? In fact, I'm just going to plop the garden saw down somewhere. Oh, let's put it on this table. Uh, is that actually on the table? Now it's on the table. Boom, garden saw on table. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's great. I used to love that. I used to love that picture. I get kick, 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 kick out of that. Use that for meme purposes on some some MMOs I used to play. Let's see, anxious. Uh, boom. Let's uh, let's smoke cigarettes. Nothing like cigarettes to just make you feel all around better. All right. Yeah. Sweet. Uh, what else can we take out of our truck here? We'll take some some nails out. All right, nails. Is there anything heavy in here? We had a lot of weird stuff. We have these two machetes. Let's let's take those out. I'll probably never find machetes again. It's so awesome. In fact, let's uh, let's decorate with them. Let's decorate with machetes. Let's place one uh, right here next to our bed. Sure, that'll be our main machete, and then we'll just kind of keep a, keep a backup machete. Uh, here in the in the boxes. Uh, yeah, uh, box of nails, boom. Sweet. All right. Yeah. Cool. I think we're gonna go on a little adventure now. Let's open the gate. Open the gate. I don't think we're going far. We never do go very far. Oh, wait, we're going pretty far. We have to go to the damn military checkpoint. That's where we're going. All right, here we go. Oh, wait, you know, no. Hang on, hang on. I closed my door. Dude, I, I can't come home and have that door be open. That would terrify me. We have to close the door before we leave. Uh, watch Monty Python and the Holy Grail for the first time. Had a good laugh. Oh, really? Really, you watched it for the first time? Yeah, I used to love that movie. Well, I still do. But, man, yeah, I used to watch it, like, religiously because it's, like, the only one I had when I was a kid. But, yeah, so, yeah, I love that. You learn a lot about English from that. I don't know if you... Did you watch it in English or... Or, uh, or is it, like, dubbed? <laughs> I wonder. Yeah, well, thanks for the recommendation. Yeah, well, I'm. All, that's awesome that you... Uh, that you, uh, that you oh, damn it. That's awesome that you saw that, dude. Yeah, that's a classic. You learn a lot. That's, I learn a lot about British people from that. You can learn a lot about British lifestyle from watching Monty Python, you know? And, you know, just their petty bickering and just being silly. You know? <laughs> it's, it's, it's fun. Um, all right. Yeah, we're going to go next door here. Oh, wait. No, no, no. I keep forgetting. We got to go to the damn... To the checkpoint. Checkpoint Charlie. Yeah, and English uh, sub subtitles in English too. Okay, yeah, yeah, sweet. So, so in English, but with English subtitles too. Yeah, okay, yeah. That's probably necessary because I mean, if you can't get that accent, it's like hard to understand like a thick British accent sometimes. 
especially since they're like talking fast and stuff. Like my dad can't do it. He's like, I, I would like, I understand about British stuff. I can't speak British. I um, love the humor of that era. Yeah, right. Yeah, no. Yeah, that's the thing. You could never make a movie like that again. Huh? It's completely politically incorrect now. You know, as it were. You know, everything good is politically incorrect, bro. Uh, but yeah, it's, it's fun. You could just you never, never, can never repeat that again. Good old Monty Python. Their other movies are less good, but still good. But yeah, that's the that's the real shiner. That's the real good one. Fall of the entertainment industry in our lifetime. Yeah, right, man. That's the thing. I mean, yeah. I mean, when when I was a kid, movies were just even better. You know, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe it's just me. I don't know. There's still some good stuff that's made. Don't get me wrong. Like, not everything is bad. Let's, let's just say that. But there's a lot of bad stuff. There's a lot of bad stuff. Oh, man. A lot of bad stuff. Um, damn, I'm getting careless about my truck here. It's going to oh para ordinance. It's a, it's a mini gun. Para ordinance. Where where is that made, Matt? Is that another Turkish company? I feel like that's like oh god. I I want to say that's like um. Is that like Brazil or something? I don't even know. Is it, I don't know. Did you buy a gun? I I don't know if he he bought one. He just he just has one. <laughs> you know, is how they roll in Turkey, man. That's Turkish people. You know, they just got guns laying around. Oh, oh, look at this huge group here. Look at that. Damn, that's a that's a lot of zombies. Zomboids, I guess. They're not zombies. Oh, Turk Turkish government make it. Ah, the Turkish government. That that that's how you know you can trust it, huh? Nothing that says quality like the Turkish government. All right, <laughs> let's uh, let's come over here. Damn, this is a lot of zombies in this town. I am gonna ruin this car. Dang it! I really need to be careful. There is a lot here. Oh, dude, that guy has a that's a ranger hat. I want a ranger hat. I don't think I can clear out this this group here though. We're gonna keep moving. We're gonna keep moving. We need those generators. We can get silly later, but we really need those generators first. Yeah, Waz, what'd you make for dinner, Waz? Anything good? I know you enjoy your food. Uh, okay, yeah, yeah, I think they're somewhere around here now. Oh, you know, I should get myself a grill, too, huh? Or maybe I'll make a fire. I don't know. I don't know what's better. All right, let's stop here. Right, we're going to have to clean some out here. Turkish show in the past, I fall in love with it about gangs and some, some guy falls in love with a girl and now his life gets messed up because of her. Oh, really? Some Turkish um, uh, show that you watched. Really interesting. Yeah, I, I, that's the thing. You never know what weird thing you like from some other weird culture. You know, I'm not to say it's weird, but ra let's say random. God, my girlfriend was recently watching like this, this Spanish soap opera thing like this spanish show like and it's all in spanish she doesn't speak a word of spanish but she loves the show so and he's saying let's, let's continue on here Uh, 
All right, sweet, sweet, sweet. Oh, it's still boiling. Okay, uh, he reminds you of that show. Oh, really? Okay, yeah, yeah. He unfortunately, like it or not, you're a representative of your country to a lot of other countries there, man. Oh, wait, did we just click on this to pick it up? Take generator. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're all judging you. Oh, oh my God. Okay, hang on, hang on. Let's. Uh, I gotta drop the generator for a sec. There's a lot of zombies coming in here. That one's crawling under my car. Why'd you go under the car, you dingus? Okay, do I have a clear shot now? No, there's still more coming in. My goodness. I gotta really baby this axe. I don't wanna break it. Uh, I don't know. Uh, oh, really? Hmm. One time I did. I did play in a movie. Really? You were in a, uh, you were in a movie one time? Yeah, that's awesome. You were full of surprise. Oh, he's, he's led a very interesting and, and jaded uh, existence. You know what I mean? Let's see. Uh,. Is that the right word? I don't know. <laughs> Take generator again. I don't know. Jaded. Was he colored? Checkered? Checkered past? Maybe? I don't know what the, the phrase is. But yeah, he's been around. Let's say it that way. Um, let's see. Boom. Where? How do I... Can we... How do I... Oh, put in, put in trunk. Can we do that quickly before this? Okay, there we go. Damn. All right. You know what? Let's move on to the next generator. I believe we got one. That's all we need for now. We just need another one for the gas station to power the gas station. I believe it's down here somewhere. And there she blows. I'm a side character, 10 seconds. Yeah, 10 seconds. Yeah, that sounds about right. <laughs> uh, Ottoman? Really? About the, about the Ottomans? That's funny. Uh, you could uh, put that in, in. Yeah, 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 right. That's really kind of awesome there. Hey, 10 seconds is more than I got. I've never been in a movie, but I have watched movies. So. Uh, that's, pretty, that's pretty cool, too. Uh, let's take this generator. Um, in fact, you know what? I, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know if, if I could ever be in a movie, you know, it would it would it would bring the quality of the movie down. Let's see. Put in container trunk. Oh, are we full? Can we not? You know what? Let's just get out of here then. Uh, can I take out my hammer? No, you have to drop the generator. All right, let's pick it up. Uh, take generator. You know, I can't work these. I have I haven't found the book that allows me to work generators yet. Let's get out. Hurry, hurry. Get in, get in, get in. Boom. Let's go. All right. We're done. We're done. We're going. <sighs> yeah, we're going to have to come back and then find more stuff here. I want a grill, maybe. Quite a bit of zombies. My goodness. I'm really glad I have this truck. We need to find another car because this one's going to get damaged pretty soon, I'm sure. Or we need to figure out how to repair this one. Start working on our, on our metalworking skill. Anyway, yeah, I don't have much of a metalworking skill in real life. You guys, I, I don't. I, I don't think I can really do anything with metal. I can drill holes in it. Um, I can hit it with a hammer. Uh, but that's about it. I can't, like, weld or anything. I, I, welding would be a good thing to have in the apocalypse. That'd be a good skill to have. I mean, uh, but yeah... Yeah, I wish I've often wished that I could we could do that. I've often like build myself like a little cage to sleep in. 
you know? Like, what are those shark cages that you, you go under the water and, like, look at the sharks at? Like, little, you just, like, chill out inside of a cage? Um, I've often wanted to make one of those for myself, but I can't make one of those. I got really, you know, I like to make things out of cork. I got this big, big bucket of corks from from wine jugs, from wine, wine bottles, I guess you call them. And I make stuff out of the cork. But that's because cork is very malleable and very soft compared to metal. Um, the metal seems to be much more hard to work with, I've found. Um, and it, it cuts you a lot more. I've never, never once cut myself on a piece of cork. There's a city in Ireland named Cork. I wonder, does Cork come from Cork? Or was Cork named after Cork? You ruined the whole budget. I'm bad, bad at acting. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> yeah. It seems like my internet is acting up. Uh-oh, internet problems, dude. Why? Why? Damn it. Damn the internet. It betrays us every damn chance it gets. Is that a key sitting there? Oh, man. Uh-huh. I wonder now. You know, that, that truck really doesn't seem that bad off. We might come and look at that. We'll come look at that. We're doing generator stuff right now, but i got to remember that. I didn't see that key before. The delay is huge. Darn it. Darn it, dude. I hate it for you. I hate it for you, dude. Hey, just imagine you're watching a YouTube video, I guess. A really, a really like, weird YouTube video. Um, same here. Really? I, I wonder if it's me, huh? For both of you guys having issues. I mean, I don't know that I can control that kind of thing, right? I, I'm, all I can do is broadcast. I, I mean, I guess it's up to you. To, to get these, so I don't know. Maybe, maybe, I don't know. I'm not like broadcasting like a very high, um, high def stream. You know, it's pretty low. It has to be all turned down because my computer can't handle much. Sweet. Back to our hidden... The coward's lair, as I call it. Let's, let's go run back to it with our tail between our legs. Sweet. So now we gotta find the book on how to... How to... To work generators. I don't know that I would need a book in real life. I don't need to know how to work one. You turn it on. You know? Or is it to repair one? Maybe I would need a book to repair one. I'm not sure. I haven't... I guess I don't know. I haven't tried. I guess before I before I say that kind of thing, I should actually try. Um, okay, so yeah, okay, yeah. Let's drop. Just drop it right here. Is is that something that's gonna happen? You know, let's. Uh, where are we gonna put our generator? Um, I guess it doesn't matter. Uh, should we put it on our roof? Maybe we should put it up on our roof. That kind of makes sense. Um, you know, a little little rooftop generator. Good thing the rain doesn't damage it. We'll kind of put it in the middle of our house here. Somewhere around here, sure. Uh, let's drop it like it's hot. Boom, generator, yay! So when the power shuts off, we'll be prepared. We won't just be sitting around in our underwear eating ice cream. We'll have power to see by. The latency to broadcaster, uh, 44 seconds now. It's mine. It's mine. Uh, um, I'm what? One Turkish guy. It's okay. <laughs> it's not okay. We need, we need better internet all around, dude. I mean, you know, you might be just one Turkish guy, but you're like, you know, 50% of my followers basically, dude. So active followers, you know. So, you and Waz. <laughs> no. Sorry if I miss a lot of your speech. The the lag is crazy. Really? That's too bad that it really messes up 
uh, the, the stream for you. That's too bad, buddy. Yeah, that sucks, man. Well, there's not much to miss, unfortunately. It's it's pretty lame. I'm, ju I'm just doing silly stuff. You know me, man. Um, are we hungry again? We're hungry again. Let's eat some choco cakes, I guess. Um, you know, this generator here, we're going to take... Oh, let's take these hand axes out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sweet, we're gonna we're gonna hoard the hell out of those. Put that in our weapon jug over here. Uh, what else do we have to eat? Oh, let's eat some grapes. That'll probably be the last grapes we eat in our lifetime. That's sad to think about. Let's uh, mm, have a frozen burrito, I guess. Uh, eat all of a burrito. Oh, how's our liquid situation doing? We need uh, we need to, we need more water. Let's fill water bottle. Yeah, no, nah, it upsets me when the internet's bad, dude. Let's see, uh, cause cause I often have that problem too, smoke. Um. Wait, why, why didn't you actually smoke the cigarette? You're still not smoking it. What the hell? You just put them in your inventory. What the hell? Smoke them now, okay? Is this going to become a thing? Is the fanny pack not working out for me? You know what? It's only 3.20 p.m. I think I'm going to go put this other generator at the, the gas station. Hell yeah. Here we go. You know, I think to find the generator book, I'm going to just go door to door in this rich neighborhood. Uh, just house by house. I got to move those trucks. I'm going to ram right into them. Oh, yeah, here it is. Okay. Yeah, so let's set up this here generator. So let's see. We got... Park Ranger just killed by a, by an axe. That's, that's sad. After all the Park Ranger games we've played, you know? Gosh. All the times you guys have sat there and watched me click... Uh, do point and click, and now we're here killing a park park ranger. It only seems fitting, really. Let's see. I guess let's drop it here. Boom! Yay! Ooh, can I? Is it? Does it have gas in it? Probably not, huh? Can I? In generator info fuel zero. Okay, so yeah, we'll have to like fill that up with gas, but at least it's there. That's the important thing. I'm going to lurk until this whole mess passes. I'm really sorry. I can't communicate very well at the moment. Ah, Waz, that's too bad, buddy. Yeah, I will. I appreciate you trying to help me in any way you can. You know what I mean? Lurking, not lurking. It's all cool. So thank you, buddy. It's sad to me, though. And I love it when you can chat with me. Because uh, really, without that, it's just some out-of-shape dude playing a video game in his, in his house. You know, like, as long as you're watching me, it's like, that's a thing now. Okay, now he's streaming, so that's okay. So yeah, dude. Freaking okay. Oh, we went too far. We went. We went too far. <laughs> See, I'm not really familiar with this area yet. Okay, is this that warehouse thing? We need to search this warehouse. There is always good stuff in warehouse. There'll be stuff to for me to to lift up my metalworking skill on with for Oh, the chopper incoming. Holy shit. Okay, we got to get we got to get in. Let's get in. Let's get in. Quick turn turn off the thing. Turn off the thing. 
Shit. Get out of the car. Get out of the car. Chopper incoming. To close this gate. I don't want zombies coming. Damn it, Chopper. Get in the house. Hide. Turn off the light. Dude, that chopper will bring them. I might finish the stream later in, uh, in your YouTube channel if I get some free time. Oh, okay. Hey, that's cool, Waz. I appreciate you doing that, buddy. That's awesome, buddy. Thank you, man. You're a you're a good you're a good person to have. I will tell you what. Thank you, man. If I had like ten more dudes like you and Matt, I would conquer the world, man. It'd be great. Uh, yeah, freaking chopper. So I guess we just we we're gonna wait here until the chopper passes. Um. I can vaguely hear it. It kind of... Oh, no, it's getting closer now. Let's have some food while we wait for it. We'll eat the piece of cheese. You know what? Um, let's, let's just sit and read our Fishing Volume 1 book while we wait sit on the ground. Whew, sweet. And our food has already worn off. Dude, this guy eats a lot. I should do a calculation on the calories that this person imbibes during a day and just and see if it's realistic. Maybe it is. I don't know. Maybe I'm just maybe I'm just being a wimp about it. That's, pro that's probably it. It's usually me coming it comes down to me being a wimp. So it's circling around again. It's st it's still out there. They need to have more chopper events. You know, they need chopper events that are different than just this one. You know, they need like. Um, I don't know, just different ones. <laughs> and and they need to have like um I don't know, more more stuff like that. Not not chopper events per se, but you know, you know, other other things that are that are things, other other um events. Like uh like a rhino. Like a rhino running through the town and escaped rhino. That'd be sweet. Sweet Minji, I'm back for a bit anyway. Oh, yeah, you were ba you're back. All right, well, I appreciate you stopping by, Sweet Minji. Thank you. Yeah, we're just hiding from a helicopter. Uh, so presumably flown by humans, which tells me there's still humans alive at this point other than myself, which that's an interesting implication. Like, they're set up well enough to want to just randomly fly over this horrible zombie zone. Like, I came from, from Riverside. Like, where are they coming from? Uh, I question that. Maybe from the other side of the river that we can't access yet. Oh, man. Oh, my ass. <sighs> mm. It's still out there choppering around. Uh, somewhere in Illinois, yeah. Back to being zombie bait, yeah. Back to being zombie bait, mosquito. Yep, exactly, buddy. Oh wait, do I still hear the chopper? I still hear it. Let's give it. A, let's give it a moment. Yeah, just hiding for, for from some of the last humans. Actually, let's be honest, mosquito. It's the humans that are most dangerous in most of these zombie movies and stuff, buddy. Yeah. It's rarely the zombies that get you. It's always the friggin' perverted psychopath humans. I think it's gone now. Okay, let's turn the light back on. Let's come out and breathe the air of a new day. Okay, I think we just survived the helicopter event. Sweet. Good stuff. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, how's things with you, Mosquito? What's new with you, buddy? How's everything? How's the fam? How's how's the wife and the little tiny baby children? 
and all the cats and the hamsters. How's the fam, dude? Anything new with you, buddy? Any particularly shitty jobs you've been on, buddy? I, I love to hear the stories of how, how crappy some of the things are that are that you're doing because it just kind of makes me feel better. Like, you know, hey, you know, at least I'm not like, you know, wading through literal shit today. But hey, Mosquito is, you know, so. So, yeah, but, you know, I'm glad that, that there's real men like you still in this in this in this world. They're good just driving through the ice. And the hamster's been dead. Oh, okay, if I already asked that and you told me it died, that's I believe I be, actually believe that. I'm gonna keep asking you about the hamster. <laughs> oh, how's the hamster? Yep, still dead. Still dead. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, mosquito. Yes. <laughs> yeah, driving through the ice though. Yeah, that's New York for you. Driving through the ice. Yeah, that's every that's every day, bro. Um, so, yeah, let's see, uh, 7.50 p.m., uh, let's eat yet more food, why not, let's eat a burrito, how much are these worth food-wise, hunger 25, I'd like to know how much the, ca how much calories they got in there, got to send people to my grandfather's basement to clean, uh, the sewer out, uh, in his basement, wow, Ooh. Okay, good. Good thing you're sending people in for that. You're not going to do that one yourself. Good thing, buddy. <laughs> That's awesome. Uh, yeah, anytime you do anything with sewers. Oh, man. Yeah, I respect plumbers. Huh? I'm too full to eat, darn it. Uh, yeah, I don't know if I could ever be a plumber. You know, because I don't know, this plumber that I get regularly, this dude, he, he like just does everything, no gloves ever. He just reaches into things and pulls things and hair globs and whatever. He's no gloves, doesn't even, doesn't care. He just doesn't care. And he's like really clean too. Every time he shows up, he's like immaculate. I'm like, how do you stay so clean? I don't understand these people. I mean, I guess it's when it's your job, you get good... Uh, plumbers are sissies. They wouldn't would go down there till it was clean. Though they wouldn't go down there till it was cleaned. Really, <laughs> that's funny. That's funny. They're like, no, no, we're not gonna do that. God, you know, I was tr recently trying to get some uh, internet cord. Uh, you know, it's a it's a cord to the internet, directly to the internet. Uh, you know, run into this room here so I could get it, you know, my computer hooked up to it, dude. And I was like, dude, I, at first we were like, well, you know, it'd be smart to just run it through the attic, you know? Dude, no one will do that anymore. We couldn't get anyone <laughs> to get in the attic and do it, you know what I mean? So instead I have this phone cord basically wrapped 60 feet around the outside of my house, like some sort of, I don't even know anymore. But yeah, people suck anymore, dude. You can't get them to do shit. Oh, we, we can't go in the attic. It's too much of a liability. Dude! Of course it's a liability. That's it's a fucking attic. There's like nails coming down and you like, you know, there's there's insulation that'll like completely ruin your life if you rub it in your eyes. But yeah, I mean it's a hazard. Get used to it. That's what I'm paying you for. Damn it. If it wasn't a hazard, it'd already be done. Yeah, people do I don't know. It's tough tough to tough to get any help anymore. <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm sure you know that, though, dude. Being an overseer, as it were, a taskmaster of men. Um, we're just gonna read our book because uh, tomorrow we have to we have to set out and like actually do stuff tomorrow. We need more food, is what we need. We're gonna go door by door and hoss by hoss and look for books and food to steal. Can we go super, super speed? We can. I usually don't like doing that because then I don't pay attention and it, and it backfires horribly. We're almost done with this fish, fishing book. That's awesome. I wonder what it says. Okay, now now we're sleepy. Now we go sleeps. Just standing outside reading, so relaxing. Well, he gets really bothered now. I think there's been an update to like, they get cabin fever like really quick. 
which I don't get. I've always hated shit like that in this type of game, dude. Outside is death, like 90%, 99% chance of death. Or you can stay inside, but no, when you stay inside, you're like, oh, but I want to go outside. It's, it's boring in here. It's like, dude, are you serious? It's the fucking apocalypse. Stay inside a bit. Holy shit. I don't understand that attitude. I, I, that shouldn't be a thing in games. It's like the same thing in RimWorld. Is if you leave them un underground or something too long, it, they get upset. It's, that's insane to me. Why? Um, well, yeah, right. Yeah, stay inside. Dog, chill. Chill, the shirt's nothing. Shut up. Yeah. Yeah, this better be good. It better be the Amazon guy or or something. It's okay, dog. The neighbors won't go away. Just chill. Just chill. Just chill. What is it, you beast? It's okay. I know you hate the neighbors. I know you hate them. You hate their dog. You sweet dog. I know. What are you doing? You want to? Be good dog. Be good dog. Be good baby. Be good baby. Good doggo. Okay, doggo. Alright, doggo, please. There you go. Be good. Oh, Alright, yeah, sweet Midgey, did I tell you? <coughs> yes. Um, oh, wait. Quiet, dog! Quiet! You're disturbing my, um, my great works. This is very important stuff I do here. I'm eating burritos in a video game, man. Silence! Moment of silence for the burrito, and I got dog hair in my eye here. Alright. Wow. Sweet. Can we, should we fill up our water jug? Fill up our water bottle. Alright. We need to, uh, go visit places. That's what we need to do. Oh, let's close our door. That's right. We're doing, we're being anal about that. Let's, um,. Because, yeah, we need to find books and stuff. And, uh, food. Really, we should probably start our garden. He will be happy with his new bed. Maybe he won't bark so much if he can sleep. Oh, yeah, did you get that pad for his little, uh, for his little bed thing? Sweet. Yeah, he's gonna, he's gonna be happy with that. He's a little comfort dude. What the hell did I just even hit? I hit the corner of this. That's not how, like, that's not how that works, game. I can't hit that like it's a fucking brick wall. Um, it's, it's like the lack of something. I hit the lack of something. That's crazy that I can hit the lack of something in a video game. I can hit the lack of, of of there being ground. There's no ground, so I whacked into it. The hell? Like, the, the English that doesn't even comp, you know, make any sense when I say those things. Um, <laughs> water equals brick. Would you rather be in the water? It was just a small corner, dude. I'm in like a, a big old pickup truck, an F-150 or something. I, I probably would have just bounced right through and I, we would have heard like a, heard a, heard a, heard a, heard a like a Ford commercial song. Like a rock. You know, that's what we would have heard is that happening. And, you know, and we would have seen like a like a shot of the Colorado Rockies, dude, with like these these hot chicks drinking a beer. That's how it would have gone down, buddy. Not not we would have been in the water. You have a lot to learn, bro. 
All right, now let's see. <laughs> let's see, where are we? Oh, yeah, yeah, we can't get distracted. Let's go back. Back this way. We need to um, uh, find things to steal them. Admit it, Mosquito. You in, in, in real life, you really want an excuse to just go into your neighbor's house and just root around in their stuff. You know, just see what they have. You know, not even necessarily steal anything. You see what's what. And then look down on them for it. Be like, oh, yeah. So you buy the shitty brand of, the, of this this um, canned cheese. You should get the spring, spring spend the extra five, five cents and, like, get the good stuff. Yeah. You know. You know, make comments like that as you go through their stuff. Like, I haven't found any tape in this house yet. Wait, you guys don't have a ta any tape? Any scotch tape? Dude, how do you tape things? Oh, we haven't needed tape. Oh, pff, you're worthless. I always need tape. Oh, wait, have we already been in this house? I think we've already been in this house. Have we looted? I don't know if we have. Why is the friggin' door open? Surely we, maybe, oh, we must have been in this house. Maybe we just came real quick and then we'd, like... Let's eat some pickles. A oh, and an orange? What if you had to eat a pickle and an orange? Canned cheese, yeah! Good old canned cheese. Why isn't canned cheese in this game? There's a lot of things that were like late 80s, early 90s that aren't in this game. Canned cheese being one of them. I can tell, you know, this game is made by like British people or something. And I can tell, because they don't have any canned cheese. They don't, probably don't understand that. Like, they don't, they don't get that concept. Like, they're way too, have way too much class to eat canned cheese, so they would, they don't understand that. Um, let's see, let's eat grapes. You know, I don't know what you'd call it. What's what's the generic term for that, like, cheese whiz crap where you just spray it out of the the can? Like, I, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, I don't know if it's canned cheese or what, what you'd call it colloquially. Um, but yeah. Yeah, they don't have any of that in British British times. Uh, we're gonna put that in our, our bag here. A briefcase, huh? Ooh, a lighter. We'll take that. Okay, not really, though. You know what we need to be looking for is, uh, bookcases? Is there any, like... Okay, here's a bookcase. Uh, the Hunter magazine. Okay, sure, we'll grab that. Tailoring Volume 1, sure, we'll grab that. We, I think we already have Mechanics Volume 1 now. Okay, so we need, um... And that's all. That's all the books over here. Okay. Well, that's too bad. Oh! <clears throat> okay. Ooh. <coughs> Chill, dog. Oh, my God. You're so high strung. Damn, this this dog is, like, tighter than a, than a... I don't even know. Tighter than a freaking drum, dude. Than a drum's butthole. Um, yeah, I guess that's all the books in this house. That's unfortunate. Oh, yeah, that's right. I think I got my bed from here. That's right. I still hear banging around. Oh, was it you, gentlemen? Don't get... Get away from my car, please. Please back up, sir. All right, we're out of here. We're going next door. Easy cheese. Is that what it's called? Easy cheese? Okay. Hmm. I could have fooled me. I never would have guessed that name. That sounds like a brand name. That seems like the, the kind of thing that, that Mosquito would scorn his neighbors for. Like, oh, they buy Easy Cheese? You should buy the, the good brand, the... I don't know, what's an, what's another name? <laughs> Mega Cheese. I don't know. Mega Milk Brand, you know? That dude had a flat top. See, that... that, that that the British understand. That they can understand about American culture. The canned cheese? No, they'll never understand that. They'll never, they'll never. Easy Cheese is the good brand. Oh, is that the good brand? Oh, okay. Wow. Well, that's canned cheese for you when Easy Cheese is the good brand. That's like saying, oh, this, this can of, of grade D sardines here is that. So that's the good one. That's all we have, is the disgusting sardines. That's the thing. Have you ever had a good can of sardines? It's like, they're all bad. Um, let's see, what do we got here? Ooh, duct tape. 
We have some in the fridge. Oh, real? Uh, that's right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Is that that brand, though? I didn't really notice what brand it is. I know it's expired, but we, yet we keep it. <laughs> so... I don't know if the expiration date actually has anything to do with anything. I was just seeing a YouTube video the other day where it was all about how expiration dates are lies. They're lies! But I don't know how, how much I can... A, a jalapeno! Let's eat a jalapeno. What kind of person would just sit there and eat a jalapeno by itself, dude? That's weird. Alright, let's, um... We need bookcases. More bookcases. This is very tedious, but it must be done. Okay, okay, trapping volume one. Sure, we'll grab that. Um. Ooh, space crew. Season three, episode five. That's one of my favorites. We'll grab that. That's funny that they only have one episode on each uh, DVD. A steak uncooked? Where? In this, on this TV? Yeah, there's carrots and a ste steak stale, uncooked. Uh, dangerous uncooked. Yeah, you need to say that again. Ooh, do we have any pills here? No. It kind of sucks that we can't uh, brush our teeth in this game. I want to brush my teeth. Oh, this is the kind of pot that I want. What's in it? Pasta fresh uncooked. We'll just grab that. Can we make the pasta? Can we, like, complete this the task? Set before, set to us by our ancient ancestors. Those who came before, as we call them. You know what? We're going to start hoarding crap in our in our freezer. Oysters. Uh, I don't know how necessary that is, but we're going to take the sausage. Just eat this radish, I guess. And we should start growing cabbages. Um, I guess. Oh, damn it. Where did that one even come from? You know what? We're out of here. You guys have lost the right to be in my presence. I am leaving. We're going next door. We're going to check the neighbor's house. Oh, this is nice. Look at all that room we got between neighbors. This is a nice neighborhood. Yeah, they're going to make me deal with them. Ooh, my axe skill went up, sweet. Yeah, I love a good axe. And my axe. I'll never get tired of saying that. And my axe. I hear Queen playing for some inexplicable reason. Oh! Oh, the don't stop me now thing? Is that what you're referring to? I thought you were actually saying that you were having hallucinatory... Uh, Audio hallucination, auditory hallucinations. There we go. That's that's the combination of words that I want. A guitar and a saxophone. That's awesome. We should probably take that, but we're not going to. Yeah. No. Okay. Yeah. Now you're making a joke there. Yeah. I get you. Yeah. From what's that movie with the fat people in it? What's it called? Well, they're not. There's only one fat guy, but they're 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 all British, though. I know that. What what what's that one called? It's zomb something about zombies. Shaun of the Dead. There you go. There you go. Yeah. Yeah, that, that was a classic one. Okay, we'll take more sausage and a, a fresh steak. Uh, and we'll take bacon, I guess. I don't know if I've ever made bacon in this game. Pepper. We'll take pepper because it's like a, a, a thing. You know, we should probably need salt, too. Let's eat this pear. We're just going through our neighbor's stuff. I really love that. Okay, where is our, uh... Okay, here's books. How to use generators! Grab! Sweet! Uh, I, I actually don't even know what else I need, really need, so now I'm very unprepared. Uh, oh, First Aid Volume 2. I have never needed that book. I have never gotten my 
my first date up probably beyond one did they add more books i don't believe so it's all the same ones i believe i mean maybe uh you know i really can't even i don't know is this door not open okay, there we go oh we need to have a smoky cigarette I don't know why I still have this beret on still. I don't know. I would never wear a beret in real life. Unless it was a raspberry beret. The kind you find at a second hand store. Good old prince. We were talking about queen. Now we're talking about other royalty. We're talking about a prince now. Uh, I tell you, we're mentioning we should mention the king too. Uh, Elvis. How can we talk about Elvis and the king of pop, Michael Jackson? You know, we need to bring Michael up. Anytime you get to talk about Michael Jackson, it's a great day. Yeah, they love him over there in Asia. Oh, that is my truck making noise. Uh, okay, you know what we're gonna do? <laughs> Let's check under the hood. It's like making a, a noise. That's not good. Let's put our axe away so I don't actually hit my accidentally hit my truck. Uh, let's let's peep. It might be the tires are bad or something, or going bad or something. Uh, oh, my hood is about to explode. My windshield's about to shatter. My engine is at 16%. Okay. We're gonna need to repair stuff. We need... Okay, did we have the Mechanics Volume 1 book? Did we, did we get that before? Let's go check our book collection. Uh, mechanics Volume 1, yeah. Did we finish the fishing one? No, we're not, but, you know, we, we didn't, but, so, yeah, but we'll take the mechanics one, we'll finish the fishing one. Okay, pasta fresh uncooked, let's put that down for now. Oh, my God. How, how do I, how do I sort this out? How do I, where do I begin here? All right, first off, did I store any other weird shit in the, in the back that I need to deal with? I still have all this random stuff that I really do need to deal with. I just I just can't be bothered at the moment. We we need to build more storage is what we need before we can deal with it. All right, so here's what I, here's what I'm gonna do. I am going to sit down and read this book real quick. Just just let's just read that. Finish the fishing book because I need to move on to mechanics. Because I'm gonna need to fix my damn truck here pretty quick. Yay! Okay, we we finished the fishing book. Okay, v fishing volume one. Uh, place item. Let's just place it here on the floor to maybe start fires with later. Uh, let's eat this pear. It's a single pear. So that's a weird thing. It's not a pair of them. It's just a, a pear, but, but singularly. Um, let's see. Uh, okay, so there's that. Okay, so here's, here's my, my boggle now. Oh, yeah, let's put this stuff in, like, fridges and freezers and stuff. Let's come over here to this freezer and just start belting stuff in there. There's bacon, the snossages and the steak, this meat patty, and that's all. Uh, oh, yeah, the pepper. Let's put the pepper uh, in this thing. We'll keep it in there and with the canned goods with our tomato paste. How to use generators. You know what? Let's read that. Let's go outside and read that. Okay, let's put these other books away first. Let's see this tailoring and oh, let's um, put the, the uh, VHS thing over here, I believe. Oops. Now, did I already read this auto one? Let's read it then. Okay. All right, let's go outside so we don't get any cabin fever. I don't think I've ever, ha ever had cabin fever in my entire life. I love being inside. I like being outside, but I also like being inside. I'm a normal human that can, like, control their emotions a little bit. 
You know, it's not like, oh shit, I've been inside for like, you know, 24 hours. I'm like trapped. The walls are closing in around me. Oh my God. Like, dude, no, I, fuck, deal with it. Damn. Anyway, let's, uh, uh, Lane's auto manual. Let's read that just, just for fun. See, let's just zip through that one. Okay, so we read that. Now the hunter, this will teach us how to make a trap box and a cage trap if we ever get to that. Let's do it. Boom, done. All right, now let's, how to regenerate, how to, wait, how to use generate. Yeah, we don't know how to use it. I thought it was to repair it, but no, it's how to use it. We straight up don't know how to use the damn thing. We're that stupid. Read. Uh, boom. Uh. Okay. I guess all of these things can now become uh, become fire stuff. Did I read? Yeah, that one dropped. Yeah, I'll I'll have a date with the fireplace. Speaking of which, we need uh, fire to to cook our pasta in there. Let's get our axe out. We need wood for a lot of stuff. Let's so let's just start doing that. Um, let's uh, equip in both hands. Let's go get ourselves some wood. Good thing we're a lumberjack, mosquito. I'm I'm back. Dumb phone calls. Oh, phone calls, dude. Oh man, you got to deal with phone calls too. I tell you, it's tough being at the top. You know, very tough. Let's see, cut down tree. You know, I'm sure maybe sometimes you yearn for the simpler days of when you were just a lowly, uh, you know, slovenly knave cleaning up ash or whatever. Now you got too much to oversee. You got phone calls, people ragging on you all the time, wanting to know where you are, why you keep billing the company for all this, like, all these bar tabs and, like, $100 lunches. Oh, uh, 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 never, I'll talk to people over, over cleaning, yeah, <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah, you're like me then, <laughs> yeah. like, I'll tell, no, 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 I'll see, I'll take it, I'll, I'll, I'll take the management over, uh, uh over the actual day-to-day, <laughs> -day. yeah, that's true, buddy, let's be honest, that sucks, I feel like a real Canadian chopping down these trees here. And down they come. Sweet. All right, let's start getting ourselves some wood. Start collecting this. You know, let's go put this axe down. Um, wood axe. Place item. We're going to put it in a pl pride of place in a place of pride. All right, boom. Uh, grab twig. And grab three log. We're about to make a captain's log here. Let's see. Uh, so, oh wait, how do we split? Yes, we need the saw, right? Grab the saw, because we need planks. So can we now uh, look at the log and then saw logs all. Saw them up. Sweet. It, it doesn't drop them. Okay, let's drop the planks. Um, okay, I need nails and th three three of the planks and nails. Let's get, grab three. Grab one. Uh, grab another one. I wish I could say grab three of them and then grab another one. It's an odd way to do things, but okay. Boom. Let's uh, go get ourselves some nails. I don't know how many nails I need, but we'll go with five of them because that's what was there. Okay, you need. Yeah, I'm gonna put a uh, uh, for like my plantings and stuff for like my um, my stuff. Uh, you know what? Maybe over here I will uh, put. Hey, how do I do this again? Let's carpentry. A wooden crate. Yeah, you know what? Let's put a wooden crate right here. This will be like to keep some outdoorsy stuff for our garden. Maybe our fishing supplies. I don't know. Something though. 
So yeah, let's see. Okay, and we got twigs now. All right, so yeah, let's let's start burning things so we can cook some spaghetti. I hate spaghetti. I don't. I would never cook spaghetti in the apocalypse. Let's grab all of these things. And too much carbs, dude. It's too much carbs. Like I need. I I like meat for meals, dude. You know. I like. I like. You know. Where meat is the main thing, and then there's sides to it. I don't like spaghetti because it's like the carbs are the are the star of that show. I'm I'm highly exerted, can barely jog. Well, that's what you get for being a lumberjack and chopping them trees all day, man. It's bad for your health. Uh, oh yeah, we're going over here. Let's see. Add uh, fuel. So tree branch, which is an hour of fuel. Uh, add. All the twigs, sure. I don't know what else to do with the twigs. Oh, yeah, the logs is what we want. Three logs. Okay. Now, um, this, uh, this pasta fresh uncooked... That, that was made for us by someone else. Uh, we're gonna take that... Can we, like, add stuff to it or something? Pasta. You know what? Actually, do we have a knife? I don't think we have a knife. We need to find ourselves a knife. We can't slice up that ham. I was thinking maybe we could put, like, some ham in the pasta. Is that a thing? But I, I don't think we can because we don't have a knife. All right. Can we start this fire? Uh, let's see. Uh, light fire. We'll use this. That, uh, that one. Oh, you know what? Yeah, boom. Right? And now we'll put the pasta in there. Did it, yeah, is it cooking now? It, it should start cooking shortly, hopefully? And there it goes. Great, let's, uh, read our mechanics book while we wait for our pasta to cook up. Uh, it just has to boil, I guess. I don't know how long it takes pasta to cook. I like it quite al dente. Why am I a discomfort? Oh, from hauling those logs, I broke my bones. Oh, it's burning! The pasta's burning. Take it off. Oh, I can't, I can't take it off while I'm reading. There we go. All right, let's smother this fire, put out fire, because I guess we're done now. I guess, I don't know. Okay, this pasta fresh uncooked. It only increases my happiness. It doesn't even say that it, like, gives me food stuff. It just say increase, plus 22 on happiness. It must really suck. Do I have anything to put on this pasta? I mean, tomato paste? Can I, can I not do that? I can add tomato paste as spice. Okay. Unhappiness 16. Uh, can I uh, add pepper? I need some salt, dude, is what I need. Wow, that increases my happiness still by 14. Uh, that's too bad. Okay, let's just friggin' eat the thing. Will it not let me? Am I too full? I'm peckish. Will it not let me eat this? Because it's so bad. That is, that's more like the spaghetti that I make. Everyone's always so, so, so you know, proud of whatever kind of spaghetti sauce they make or something. I, I'm not. I, I make bad stuff. And this is very similar to real life. Like, it doesn't even give you the option to eat it. I, I'm confused as to what's happening here. Uh, let's, let's pause this. Real breaking, Darwin. Unless you have a mod breaking something, you might need bowls at least, too. Maybe that's it, Doorknob. Good to see you, buddy. Haven't seen you in a while, but thank you for stopping by. Yeah, I guess it must be the bowls thing. Uh, I've never, you know, I've, I don't know if I've ever actually drunk out of the, that big thing. I thought you could, though. Yeah, we're gonna have to find bowls. Yeah, because we 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 don't have any bowls. <laughs> All right, here's our here's our new plan. We're gonna place the tomato paste. You know, and and it's you know it's all also uh, very possible. I do have a mod breaking something. This is the first time I've tried doing this. So, 
He's going to place our, our, our spaghetti there. It's 7 p.m. We're not in a very good state to go out. Uh, let's just have a cigarette. You'll be able to, but I think they changed it for... Really? Uh-huh. Okay, you used to be able to. Really, did they change it, doorknob? Okay, hmm. Keep it in the fridge or it'll rot overnight. Oh, yeah, you're right. I should pop it in the fridge. Yeah, I probably will not get out to the next day. It's already 7 p.m. So, yeah, I should pop it in the fridge. It just it looks nice out on my counter there, you know? Uh, let's grab the thing. Let's throw it in the fridge with... with the onions and the ham that we can't chop up. Okay, so we need bowls and we need knives. Or one knife, at least. That'll be a good thing for us to do tomorrow. We're still hungry. All right, let's 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 eat some of the stuff that, you know, we can eat. Ooh, we'll eat these Twinkies. Plonkies. You like Twinkies in real life, Doorknob? I do. I, I could go for a Twinkie right now. Uh... They're awful for you. I mean, they make me feel like I'm dying when I eat them. But it's a it's a sweet, tasty death, you know? Oh, we don't have Twinkies in the UK. Oh, you're from the UK, dude. Oh, well, that nice. Well, that's one thing you have over us, then. That's why you're probably a little bit thinner than the average American, I would imagine. Because you don't have those, buddy. I didn't know you are from the UK. Or maybe I did know that and I just, like, spaced it. But, yeah. That's awesome, bro. That's one thing you do have over us. You don't have the Twinkies. All right, let's see. I'm sure you got other things that are awful for you. But um, let's eat this burrito. Like, what, what's the worst thing that comes from, from, from the UK that's, like, like health-wise? Like, because I love a, a good pork pie, you know? Can't go wrong with that. That's not really that bad for you. I'm trying to think. Surely there's, like, some weird, weird... Weird dessert that they make or something that's awful for you. I don't know. There's got to be. Every every country has it, I'm sure. Let's see. Um, I guess we could just... Um, the milk. I guess we'll just save that. I don't know what I would ever use the milk for. I guess we can eat one of these ice creams. We'll do that. Because I always usually just hoard the damn ice cream. Ah, full to bursting. Excellent. All right, let's go outside, read our book, and then we'll go to bed. And then we'll begin the search for bowls and a knife. Our stuff is healthy. Obviously, we do have sugary stuff, and we don't uh, have the chemistry experiment levels of sugary stuff that the U.S. has. Yeah, unfortunately, probably not, huh? Just like treacle pudding and, uh, you know, normal, like, desserty things, unfortunately. Uh, you're right, the chemistry experiment. That's a good way to put it. That's a good way to put it, buddy. Yeah, put a little sugar in your tea. <laughs> yeah, that's nothing compared to the, yeah, <laughs> chemistry experiment. Because, yeah, like those Twinkies, they don't go bad, ever. Like, there's nothing biodegradable in them. You know, it's all just, like, false synthetic poison. <laughs> no. uh, anyway, good stuff, though. It's tasty poison. Mm -hmm. So, um, What was I doing? Oh, yeah, we're going next door. We're going, going shopping for a knife. We need a kitchen knife. And, uh, you know what? I'm, I'm very reticent to take my truck. It doesn't work anymore. I, I, it's a 16%. Um, a friend of mine went to the U.S. for a holiday and brought back a bag of sweets. They were just rectangles of sugar flavoring. <laughs> sugar with flavoring. The watermelon flavor was nice. There you go, buddy. Yeah, yeah. That's disappointing. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we do have good stuff here, but I, that yeah, probably wasn't one, one of them. You know, yeah, really for desserts, you want uh, uh, like a little bit east of you and north. Like, like the northern Europe, for some reason, has great desserts and chocolate and stuff for some reason. I don't know. Dutch chocolate, you know. Uh, you know, the Danes, for some reason, have delicious stuff. Why? I don't know. 
Like, I guess because it's really cold over there, and so they, like, need something to look forward to. They need a good, a good pastry. Or else they'll just kill themselves, because it's fucking cold. Uh, let's see. Um, yeah, I guess I'm just going to have to walk it. I'm really reticent, but I'm just going to have to walk it. No, 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 I can't walk it. We'll take the truck. We'll just be very careful with it. I don't want to have to waste the time. It, it still starts up. Yeah, they have really nice chocolate in Northern Yab. Yeah, right, exactly, huh, buddy? That's where the good stuff is. Yeah. Like, all of our shit sucks. Like, Hershey bars and stuff. It's really kind of crap. Like, you want a Kinder bar, you know? You want, like, that weird German stuff. Or something like that. Okay, I think we've been there. Uh, I believe we've been there. <laughs> of course, I we weren't really looking for bowls and, and knives at that point, but still we've been there. Let's see, we have not been to the flamingo house here. In fact, we might have to keep some of these flamingos for ourselves. Okay, they're really going to get attracted here. Let's, um, let's clear out some of these, these naughty, naughty zombies. Okay. Boom. Uh, boom. Ooh, that that one looked kind of hot. I'm sad that we had to to execute that one. It looked like she was like had the, the big glasses on. She was like a hot streamer, babe. Let's see. Uh, the the U.S. doesn't put vegetable oil in the chocolate, which was uh, uh, I see it results in in a worse flavor. That's interesting. You know, I didn't know that. I did not know that, buddy. They probably put some other poisonous shit in there that's, like, slightly cheaper to use, so that's why they do it. You know? <laughs> like... Oh, the door is locked, and I can see a dude in there. Oh, okay, let's, uh, remove the glass from this. Yeah! Yeah! I don't know how you can, like... I don't know. I don't know. I guess people keep buying the shit, so they keep making it, but whatever. Eventually, you get to a point in your life where you develop, you know, taste. And you'll figure this stuff out, you know. But, yeah, until then, it'll keep those companies afloat, I guess. Let's see. Okay. Electronics magazine. We probably don't even need that. Trapping volume four. I will never get to that point. Yeah, corn syrup. Oh, my God. The corn syrup. I got to try so hard to not get stuff with freaking corn syrup in it. And yet, I'm, i got a Mountain Dew right here. It's loaded with corn syrup. I don't know the exact chemistry of food science behind why. I just know that from reading explanations from people who do know that stuff, that that is why. Interesting. Okay, yeah, huh. Cool. Yeah, you seem to know a lot of interesting things there, doorknob, you know. Uh, yeah, mosquito, the friggin' corn syrup, dude. Yeah, I got it. Like, yeah, you gotta pay extra for something with, like, sugar in it. Like, please, sir, let me have, let me kill myself with sugar Rather than your your fucking corn syrup, you know what I mean? Like, it's pretty bizarre world we've created for ourselves. Uh, I don't think we have a can opener. Let's take that. We don't need the cans yet, because those won't go bad. We can always come back for them. Um, the thing is with this this salmon, I kind of I th kind of think we should take that. That's awesome to find a salmon. Okay, a knife. Is that a knife? A kitchen knife. Yes. Okay, let's find a couple bowls here, huh? No? Oh, wait. Is that salt? Sweet. Do you ever run out of salt and pepper? I don't think so. Since I already have a pepper, we're not going to take this pepper. Unless you do. I mean, in real life, you do run out of salt and pepper. I mean, I, I don't know. Grab the fresh stuff and bring it home while it's still fresh. Once it rots, it's gone for good, so I can't save the cans. Yeah, save the cans for later, yeah. Uh, I think I got, I don't know, let's see what else is fresh. I mean, it's, it's good. Okay, yeah, yeah, there's some, like, stuff I could probably cook with. Um, let's just take it all. We'll put it in our backpack. Uh, the thing is, it's usually, like, 
you know, processed cheese and pickles and stuff that's worth like five food. <laughs> and so I'm like, uh, whatever. All right, all right. You know, let's let's go upstairs in this fancy place. Oh, you know what? No, um, let, we're gonna actually just leave because I really do need some bowls. I really do, because if, if if they updated it so that I like actually need bowls to eat my soup now, then that's gonna that's gonna complicate things. I will need bowls, at least two. Yeah. Um, oh, this this guy's gate is partially closed, and that idiot can't figure out how to go around it. Ooh, a piano. I wish we could do something with that. That would be so cool. Oh, I can disassemble it. A western piano, huh? Interesting. I wish we could actually play the piano. That'd be so cool. Grab a frying pan, a griddle pan, if you can't uh, make stir fries. You know, yeah, I've never gotten involved in that. I should. Uh, and cooking food increases the value. Yeah, I always make the soups. Like, the soups are easy. But yeah, I have never made the stir fries. Because, yeah, I just never have. I should probably do that. Hexum 40. Thank you. Thank you, Hexum. I appreciate that. Thank you for the follow. That's awesome. Uh, okay, yeah, we'll just leave all that. What I need bowls. Um, you know, when you need one, you won't find it. Okay, there is a frying pan. I'll take the frying pan so I can make your stir fries. You know, the kettle, I think I have a kettle. I need to start collecting. Okay, I, I don't have a teacup. Well, we can make ourselves tea, I think. We'll take the teacup. We need to start collecting tea bags. <clears throat> All right, let's take this stuff here. We'll just leave, leave the water bottle. Uh, sweet, okay, anything in here? Nope. Okay, yeah, bowls. Still need bowls. Oh, where did this one come from? Hey there, says Hexum40. Hey there yourself, Hexum. How you doing today? Thank you for stopping by. Kitchen knife in that cupboard, says doorknob. Hello, says uh, Mosquito. The one under the kitchen, the sink has a knife. Yeah, no, I know, I did. I think I collected a knife, though. Did I? Oh shit, did I? Yeah, I got one. And one is all I need, because I'm not actually going to use it against zombies. I'm just going to keep it in my kitchen to slice ham. You know, <laughs> so... Yeah, but you know, theoretically, I probably should have backups, but eh. I'm, I'm not, I'm never going to hit a zombie with it, hopefully. Uh, you know. Yeah, just to slice ham and make soups. If I can find bowls, dude. Like, I would never use the same knife that I use on zombies to, to, to cook with. Can you imagine that? That would be so nasty. Like, you could never disinfect it enough for me. Um, I didn't see you had, but yeah, 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 sorry. Yeah, no, no problem, dude. I'm good. I love Zomboid. Uh, like to see people streaming it. Yeah, Zomboid's a great game, isn't it, Hexum? You played a lot of it, buddy? Uh, you in the hundreds of hours count? Yourself, dude. Yeah, it, Zomboid's just a friggin' great game. I mean, it's it's great. It's great. And, you know, you can mod it easily. It's fun, and they're still adding stuff. Oh, dude, this is a survivor house. Okay, there's gonna be good stuff in here. Um, let's uh, uh, let's uh, unbarricade this door. Let's get in here. This is gonna be good. It's a big old place. That's a survivor house too. This is great. There we in we go. Okay. A satellite dish? A 20-pound satellite dish. Wow. I have never seen that. Why is there a satellite dish in this on this shelf? That's interesting. I kinda wanna I kinda wanna take the satellite dish. Let's get my my axe here. 
Okay, you know what? We're uh, we, we're getting anxious here. Let's have a cigarette. You know what, let's clean out a couple of these ones. Sweet, oh, this gnome! We're gonna take the gnome! I didn't see the gnome at first. We gotta take the gnome. I love the gnomes ever since my Fallout days. And the, cre the creepy gnomes in that game. Let's just kill off this guy so he just doesn't sneak up on me while I'm cherishing the gnome and talking to it. We're going to name this gnome. But first, we got to get it. Let's see. Can we uh, pick it up? David the gnome. It already has a name. Okay, David. You're coming with us, Dave. Let's throw it in the back of our truck. Uh, David the gnome. And in he goes. Sweet. It's quite a heavy thing. Wow. Cool. Got a lot of hours, but haven't played for a year or more. So interesting to people playing to see what's changed. Yeah, I wonder. Yeah. Uh, that's the thing. Yeah, I'm kind of coming back myself. That's why I'm kind of doing this playthrough is to see Louisville. Because I, I just never got, I never played Louisville. Muldra was my town, man. That's always where I started. I just really love that warehouse there. And I just would do that every time I'd fire up the game. I'd be like, I'm going to do something different. And then I would be in Muldra again in that same warehouse. By this time, I'm trying some Louisville action. Okay, books. What do we What do we need on books? Oh, okay. No books in this bookcase, even though it appears that there is books. Uh, wow. Okay, yeah. Wow. This is why survivor houses are awesome. I don't even know where to start. Um, we'll take the shotgun shells. That's awesome. Uh, we'll take the 45 ammo. We'll take the 556. I don't even know. This is this is crazy. A, a 1911 sweet. We'll take that. I don't even know. We're gonna leave the rest of that because I'm just I'm so confused. That's that's awesome. I love survivor houses. We're gonna have to just come back for that stuff. And just really clean this out. Uh, let's close the curtain so we can get a little privacy in here. <clears throat> uh, I missed that game. I may play it again soon. Yeah, Mosquito, it's always tough. Secret secret books that conceal a gun safe. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, that's how that's how, how they roll. All right, I think there's someone naughty behind here. Yeah. Jesus, yeah, here's their laundry room with a spiked baseball bat. I never play with those. We're going to take that. That's awesome. Another wood axe. All oh, this is good stuff. I'm not even going to take it because I'm going to have to come back for it all. This is great. Man, I love I love the survivor houses. Let's check around. What, what does their kitchen look like? Do they have any bowls? <laughs> it's really my question. That's why I'm here. Okay, they have matches. I'll take that. Oh, they got the good flashlight. Oh, they have. Okay, this is where they keep their clothes. The wood axe is amazing for cutting trees. Yeah, I gotta love the wood axe. Tires the hell out of you for... Uh, for cutting zombies. Oh, a hunting knife. Damn, let's take that. We can cut our ham with that. And a shovel. Ah, damn, we probably need a shovel. Um, uh, let's just keep looking for these balls. That's really what I'm trying to do here. All right, well, what do you have in the fridge? Okay, this apple. We're just going to eat it right now. Just sit there eating apple. I don't know if I trust stuff I found in other people's fridges, but I guess if you're hungry, you're hungry, dude. We're gonna eat that peach, too. Uh, we're gonna eat these pickles. It's lunchtime, anyway, you know. Uh, eat the yogurt. We're well fed now. Hopefully this will take us up a little bit more. Satiated, that's fine. All right, the ground beef, I guess I guess we'll try to get that into a fridge back home. Anything in the freezer? Okay, yeah, we'll take these pork chops, I guess. We'll take the meat patty and the bacon. We're not going to touch the vegetables. We're in Kentucky, dude. Uh, let's see. Oh, yeah, that wood axe again. Yeah, those are golden. In fact, yeah, I should probably take, take a backup one here, you know. Uh, Jesus Christ, hell yeah. Oh, my God, this is great. Do they have any... 
44 Magnum rounds. This is so awesome. 44 Magnum rounds. A Magnum. Shotgun shells. Oh, this is great, dude. Yeah, okay. So I'm just going to have to, like, remember this house is here. Let's check upstairs. We're just going to have to clean this place out. God, it's so lucky to get a, get a survivor house. That's awesome. Usually I just get burned down houses. Wow, okay, they, they, more hammers and stuff in the closet. What the hell? Ground beef is good. It's worth like 30 food if I remember. Really, ground beef, just fry it up and eat it. Yeah, I'll probably end up uh, sticking it into a soup. Yep. If I can find some bowls to put it in. Ooh, bandages. Soap. More soap, sweet. Hell yeah. Jesus, more weapons in the closet. I don't even know anymore, dude. And there are tools up here in the in the in the bookcases. Okay, yeah, the bookcase has the got uh, a leaf rake in it. How did they put a, a rake in there? Okay, whatever, man. That's cool. Wow, they really went crazy with the curtains. I like how they put the curtains up at this front part. So I'm looking at, at the stuff like the package version of oh, that's a really good find. <laughs> Insanely rare loot, so I have to scavenge. Oh, I see. Okay, yeah, see, I don't do that. <laughs> yeah, see, with the veggies and stuff, I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna. I, I, what I need to do is start growing my own stuff and fishing and stuff. That's really kind of what I usually do, play style wise, I guess. But yeah. Yeah, but I'm just going to have to come back to this place. This is too good. It's too good. Yeah, I admire you, though, for playing on the rare loot. Um, let's see. It's 1.30. Let's just go this way again. Yeah, dude. You know, I sh probably should, dude. I should probably do that. Challenge myself to turn it all the all down. Okay, don't don't die on me now, car. I really I gotta figure out how to fix my car is what I need to do. Okay. Oh. There's a lot of people in here. Zombies. Are zombies people at that point? Can we say they're people in here? I mean, they used to be people. Oh, bourbon. Sweet. I, I don't know why. We live next to a bourbon factory, but we're still going to take the bourbon. Um, I would love a bowl. Oh, a meat cleaver. Damn. All right. Well, let's take that. Yeah. Oh man, this is this is good stuff. They got matches all over the place and stuff. What I need Alright, hang on, let's <clears throat> would be tempted to move in. Yeah, dude, these this is a really good place to live, I think. These houses on this river here. Uh let me see, am I being attacked here? No. Okay, so yeah, there's this map here. I mean, I would think that yeah, all these nice houses here along the river. Uh, here in Louisville, I mean, the size of this town is it's, it's huge. Uh, but yeah, I mean, it's any of these. You could pick any one of these, and it would be a, a great base, I'm sure. Um, I, I'm just, yeah, there's uh, some really nice stuff. Uh, it, especially with these fireplaces. Like, I like the fireplaces for cooking. Um, uh... Uh-oh, don't know why you live by a bourbon factory. <laughs> yeah, no, the bourbon's great, dude. It keeps morale up. You disinfect stuff with it. It's great. Wow, there's a lot of people in this house. Okay. Wow, okay, yeah. Sweet crowbar, man. 
All right, what I need is more of those, uh, those weird inf informational books, dang it. Okay, yeah, and I don't need any of that. Darn it, okay. How about the desk? Does the desk have books in it? No. All right, and no bowls, unfortunately. Obviously. Let's see, where is the, um... You just make make dead sure that there is no yeah. There's a dead mouse. I'm I'm tempted to start a, like a dead mouse collection, but at the same time, oh, okay. See, we're gonna take all this though. That goes in the backpack, especially the milk. Don't you need the milk to bake with? Like, yeah. I don't know. I've never baked anything either. Oh, look at that! A frozen ham. See, now that's good. That I will take, buddy. Okay, we're we're done. We're we, we're we're getting full. We're getting we're getting heavy now. Uh, matches. A box of sparklers. Interesting. Yeah, okay, but no bowl. No bowl. And we'll leave, we'll leave the canned food for now. But yeah, we'll go home with all this, this weird refrigerated stuff we have here. Yeah, and we need to start working on how to repair this car. Start welding or whatever. And being careful not to hit any zombies with it. Oh, we're getting hot even. Unpleasantly hot. Wow. It must be a hot day out here. Oh, it's 100 degrees Fahrenheit. 100.2. Wow, and it's probably really muggy in this rain. 100 degrees and it's raining. That would probably be very uncomfortable. All right, have a good stream. My child wants my phone. Oh, okay. Uh, you're an awesome dad, Mosquito. An awesome dad and an awesome follower to have, buddy. Thank you for showing up, man. Have a great day. Take care of yourself, man. Yeah, passing by the bourbon factory. That's how you know we're almost home. Oh, don't... Okay. Yeah, so in a, in an actual like a hardcore run, you know, I, I still I still stand by the fact that the Bourbon Factor would be a freaking great place to live. Terrible driver. Damn it. Yeah, I'm, I'm bad. I just... Oh, wait. No. I always forget to turn the car off. Let's turn it off. Oh, it is off. Okay, sweet. Boom. That's so awesome. We're, we're doing good now. We're collecting. All right, let's get this gnome out. Uh, let's... Let's put the gnome... Where's the gnome? Here's the gnome. Let's place item... Oh, yeah, it'll go perfectly right there. Boom, that is great. David, protect us. Look at its dead black eyes. Look at that, dude. I don't even see that. Oh, my God, that's a horrifying gnome. Okay. Well, that yeah, that's terrifying. That looks... I wonder if the devs are, like, trying to do something creepy with that. That's disturbing. You know the the Germans got the good chocolate, but they gave us the the the, the gave the world domes too, so that, that it balances out. All right, let's let's come in, close the door. All right, we're gonna we're gonna stop for right there. Um, wow, Hexum, thank you for showing up. Real Bork breaking doorknob, thank you for showing up. Mosquito showed up earlier. Matt, Waz, you guys, sweet Midgey, everyone was showing up today. That was so awesome, and thank you. Hexum for for the following. Nightcore Gaming came on earlier and gave me a follow. That's so awesome. Anyway, guys, uh, take care of yourselves. Huh? I'll be back soon. But until then, uh, enjoy and you know, be, be live your best. Don't get eaten by zombies, guys. Anyway, take it easy.